Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Oh. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. In this... Oh, the alarm's going off already. Oh, it feels like I just fell asleep. Oh, well, guess it's time to get out of bed. Oh. Molly, time to wake up. Molly, Mo Molly? Wh where's my sister? She's up before me? Wh wh what's going on? I better go downstairs and find out. Hmm. This is a delicious waffle. A great way to start my day. Delicious. Molly, what's going on here? What's going on is that you better get ready for school or you're going to be late for the bus. But, but Molly, how did you get up before me? You'd never wake up before me like ever. <gasps> you're an imposter. You're not my real sister. <laughs> what, I can't turn over a new leaf, Daisy? I just wanted to be on, on time at school today. What? You never want to be on time. For that matter, you've had detention ten times already this week for not being on time. Ten times? Daisy, there's only five days in the school week. How could I have detention ten times? Okay, well, you know what I mean. So seriously, who are you? And what have you done with my sister? Daisy, I'm just excited about school, okay? Mm, this waffle's great. Excited about school? Now I know you must be sick. You got a bonk on your head, didn't you? No, I just really am excited. You better get out of those pajamas or we're going to be late for school. Hmm, excited about school. <gasps> I know, it must be pizza day. <laughs> yeah, it is pizza day. That explains everything. You love pizza day. Also, today is early dismissal, so I only have to be at school for like two hours. Oh my gosh, I forgot about early dismissal. Hmm. This apple's good. Well, that explains it. I was going to say, uh, I knew you weren't excited about the science test. Science test? Just kidding. It's a math test. Math test? Oh, man, I didn't study. Well, I better get ready for school. It's a half day, which is pretty exciting. I mean, I love school and stuff, but everybody needs a half day once in a while. Maybe we could have a sleepover. That would be amazing. <laughs> la, 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 la. My name is Daisy, just like the flower. Daisy, come on! The bus is here! The bus is here! Okay, class. Uh, no looking on each other's papers. This is a graded math test. I hope you all studied. Oh, no. I didn't study. Good thing these problems seem pretty easy. Seems like today is my day. Pizza for lunch, early dismissal, easy math problems. Molly, quiet. There's no talking during a test. Yeah, Molly, no talking. You too, Daisy. I wouldn't want to give you detention. Eee! Detention? Um, no, I was just telling Molly to be quiet. Okay, Daisy. Well, you be quiet too, okay? Okay, Mr. Smith. <laughs> Goody two-shoes, Daisy got in trouble. Daisy got in trouble. Molly, do you want detention? You'll have to stay after early dismissal. Holy guacamole! No, I don't want to stay here after dismissal. <laughs> That'd be funny. Okay, time's up, everybody. Time to hand in your test. Wow, that was a piece of cake. Attention, students. As you all know, today is an early dismissal, so you're free to go. Have a great afternoon. Maybe you could do some extra studying. <laughs> Extra studying. She's funny. Come on, Molly. Let's go. Hold on, Daisy. I have to use the bathroom really quick. Hurry up, Molly. Seriously. Uh, yeah. I told you I'll be at the mall at 3 o'clock. Duh. Oh, hey, Sarah. Uh, hey, Lily. Whatever. You're not popular. Don't talk to us. Fine. Cheapers creepers. Rude. So, did you hear about this new 3 a.m. challenge? What? No. I haven't heard anything about this, Sarah. What are you talking about? Is this some sort of cheerleading ch challenge? No. <laughs> Apparently, there's this monster that lives in Brookhaven. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Totally listening to their conversation right now. <laughs> yeah, there's a monster. And if you look in your mirror at 3 a.m., it comes out and it gets you. What? That sounds so creepy, Sarah. Oh, 
M G. Yeah, so whatever you do, do not take a dare to look in your mirror at 3 a.m. Well, is it, it just in the school mirror? Because we're not even in school at 3 a.m. No, it's in any mirror in Brookhaven at 3 a.m. So even if you want to check your hair in the middle of the night to make sure it looks amazing, don't do it. Well, I could use like my makeup compact mirror. <laughs> That's way too small for a monster to be in. This monster is magic. It can come out of any mirror that it wants. Oh my gosh. That sounds terrifying, Sarah. Holy guacamole, that sounds terrifying. Uh, were you listening on our conversation? Uh, yeah, I was using the bathroom and it was kind of hard not to hear. I mean, a monster that comes out of a mirror at 3 a.m.? Yeah, I totally believe her, right? Um, I don't know. It sounds really scary, but I don't think I believe you, Sarah. What? But I'm popular. You should believe me. Uh, just because you're popular doesn't mean you don't lie. Well, she has a point, Sarah. I'm not lying. The 3 a.m. monster is real. My brother saw it and thankfully he got away. OMG, that sounds terrifying, Sarah. Are you mocking me right now? Uh-huh, I sure am. Well, do yourself a favor and at 3 a.m. see if you can look in the mirror at your house tonight and the monster will take care of you. Uh-huh, sure it will, Sarah. Bye! 3 a.m. monster mirror. Monster coming out of a mirror. That <laughs> sounds ridiculous. Whoa! It got dark really fast. Let's get you in the bathroom forever. It looks like we're gonna get a storm, actually. Holy guacamole, I guess so. <laughs> Those are some dark storm clouds. We better get home, Miley, before the rain hits. Good idea, Daisy, good idea. Wow, I thought early dismissal would be more fun, but since it's like storming outside, I can't do anything. I just, I'm just watching these cute videos of a llama, but it's stuck on this picture because the internet is out. Oh man, you can't even watch TV or anything because of this giant storm. Hey, wait a minute. I have an idea. Hello? Oh, hey, Molly. <laughs> What's up? Hey, Brookie. How you doing with this giant storm? Oh, it's so boring at my house right now. Yeah, mine too. The internet's out. TV doesn't work. Good thing the cell phone still works. Hey, anyway, I was wondering, do you want to come over for a sleepover? I have sort of a challenge that I need my best friend for. I'd love to, Molly. Uh, just give me a minute to pack my bag and I'll be over. Okay, well, don't forget your umbrella because there's some serious rain coming down outside. Don't worry, Molly. I will. See you soon. Bye. Hey, Guess what, Daisy? Guess what? What? What's a great guy? Brookie's coming over for a sleepover. We're gonna do a challenge. A challenge? What kind of challenge? You'll see. Oh, Brookie's here. Molly, hurry. It's 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 really storming outside. Come on in, Brookie. Whoa, looks like you packed for a week. Are you staying for one night or did you move in? <laughs> this is just all my stuff. I got my sleeping bag in here, my pajamas, some snacks. Ooh, snacks. Did you bring cupcakes? Ew, Molly, she's not going to pack cupcakes in a suitcase that get all smushed. But I love cupcakes. Delicious cupcakes. Uh, Molly, snap out of it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was just dreaming about cupcakes. She's always dreaming about cupcakes. All right, well, I guess the first thing we should do is eat a snack because dreaming about cupcakes made me super hungry. Who wants an ice cream? I do. I'm going to do some studying and then I'll hang out with you guys. Studying? Daisy, come on, live a little. Okay, fine. I'll get an ice cream with you guys. Brookie, do you want an ice cream? Um, yeah, but could you scoop it for me? Sure. I'll scoop some for you. Whoa, this two scoops of ice cream is delicious. What are the two flavors? Mmm, tastes like cookie dough. Good guess. Cookie dough and molten chocolate lava. One of my favorites right now. Ooh, molten lava chocolate is one of my favorites too. Well, what should we do now? Well, it's storming outside, so we can't go in the pool. We could get in the hot tub. Why don't we do that? Sounds fun. Hopefully our ice cream doesn't melt though. <laughs> Last one in the hot tub is a rotten egg. <laughs> It's Brookie. Brookie's the rotten egg. I'm still getting my bathing suit on. Cheapers. Well, my ice cream's starting to melt. I've got to. I've got to eat it faster. Mm, this is really good. Ah, brain freeze. Brain freeze. Ah! Molly, you're so funny. This is so much fun. I'm like super warm from the hot tub and super cold from the ice cream. Okay, let's turn on some bubbles. Ooh, turn on some purple lights too, Molly. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. I absolutely love sleepovers at you guys' house. It's so much fun. Oh, but it's getting really late. I'm ready for bed. Really? Already, Daisy? I am too. Uh, I wish that it wasn't storming so we could have went outside, but eating ice cream and hanging out in the hot tub was fun. Yeah, it sure was. Okay, well, let's put our 
your pajamas on and get ready for bed, I guess. La 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 la. There, I'm all cozy in my PJs. Brookie, are you gonna come up to um to bed? Or are you just gonna hang out on the hot tub and sleep here? No, I was just waiting for you to get out of the bathroom, silly. <laughs> oh, yeah, that makes sense. Ah, this has been a super fun sleepover, but I haven't even told Brookie about the challenge yet. I wonder if she'll be afraid of the mirror monster. Oh my gosh, Molly, we bought the same pajamas. <laughs> Aren't they adorable, though? They so are, and they're so comfy, too. Okay, where's your sleeping bag, Brookie? You can put it right here. Okay, Molly, sounds good. Um, so you said on the phone you needed help with the challenge? Did you do the challenge by yourself? No, the challenge is in the middle of the night at 3 a.m. Wait, what? Yeah, basically, they're supposed to be a monster that comes out of your mirror. Wait, what? Yeah, Sarah was talking to her friend in the bathroom at school, and I overheard them, and then I asked her about it because I was b basically eavesdropping. Oh, Molly. Yeah, and guess what? She was telling her friend that if you look in any mirror in Brookhaven at 3 a.m., a monster will come out and get you. OMG, Molly, that sounds terrifying. Nah, I think she's just full of it. She's... Totally full of the beans. <laughs> <laughs> Molly, you're so silly. That's what I thought. I think that basically she's making it up. I think this is a very bad idea, Molly. D -d 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 Don't look at the mirror at, at 3 a.m. Nah, um, who's with me? Who's gonna look? Not me. I'm not getting out of bed at 3 a.m. to see a monster. No way. I will, Molly. Just wake me up, okay? Okay, I'll set my alarm for 2.55. Good night, Daisy. Good night, Molly. Good night, Brookie. Good night, Molly and Daisy. <laughs> What? What? Oh my gosh. It's it's 2.55 a.m. Okay, I've got to wake up Brookie. Ah, we have to look for the mirror monster that doesn't exist at 3 a.m. Just so I can prove Sarah's lying. Brookie! 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 Oh my gosh, she's sleeping. Brookie! 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 Come on, we have to go look at the mirror monster! Molly, go away. It's so late. I'm so tired. But Brookie, you're supposed to do this 3 a.m. challenge with me. Brookie! Oh my gosh, she's not gonna wake up. Oh well, there's no such thing as a mirror monster in Brookhaven anyway. So I can go by myself. Yeah, I'm not afraid at all. Okay, Brookie, have fun sleeping. <laughs> now what mirror am I gonna look in? I'll look in the upstairs bathroom mirror. Definitely not gonna be anything in here. I'm not afraid. I I I'm not afraid at all. Mirror monster. Everybody knows Sarah's just a bully. And she's full of beans. I don't see anything. Oh, mirror monster. Where are you? Pfft, mirror monster. This is ridiculous. I don't know what Sarah was talking about. Pfft, mirror monster. There's no mirror monster. <laughs> Wait till I tell everybody tomorrow that it was a total prank. And Brookhaven is mirror monster free. <sighs> I'm going back to bed. How ridiculous. <sighs> Well, Brookie, you didn't miss anything by sleeping at 3 a.m. <laughs> no mirror monster here. <sighs> Time to get some sleep. Shh. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> what was that, that sound? It, it sounded so creepy. Is, is anybody there? Oh, it's just Brookie. Maybe she's snoring really weird or something. <laughs> that mirror monster's got me totally creeped out. Don't be ridiculous. I'm just gonna go back to sleep. It sounded like a creepy monster. At that time, I really did hear it. Uh, uh, there's, there's, there's nothing there. Oh my gosh. I know I heard something that time. I know I did. Okay, I'm just freaking out right now. This is ridiculous. Stop it, Molly. Seriously, stop it. Go to sleep. Uh, I, I swear I heard something really creepy. And I'm afraid to close my eyes. Okay, I, I know I'm just being ridiculous. I, I need to go back to sleep. Shh.
Oh boy, it's time to wake up already. Holy guacamole, that night went really quick. Um, Brookie, wake up. You don't want to be late for school, do you? Uh, I'm still sleepy. Molly woke me up in the middle of the night. Oh, she actually did that challenge? I don't know. She actually said she was going to. Uh, I can't even open my eyes. I'm so tired right now. Whoop. We better wake her up or she's going to be late for school. As usual. Okay, uh, I'll go wake her up. <sighs> Molly! Molly, it's... Molly? Daisy, she's not up here. What? Yes, she is. No, she's not. Look for yourself. What? M Molly? Oh, maybe she just got up early again today. No, you don't understand. Today is not a pizza day and it's not early dismissal. She would not get up out of bed for anything. What? No, I'm sure she's just downstairs. You don't understand. Something really weird's going on here. Oh my god, Daisy. You you don't think the 3 a.m. mirror monster got her? What? No, of course not. <laughs> I don't know. Something seems really weird. I kept hearing these weird rattling sounds in the night. I thought it was just Molly had gas from eating all that ice cream, but maybe it was a monster. OMG! Do you think so, Boogie? I don't know, but I, I just want my best friend back. Molly? Molly? Where, where, where are you? <laughs> I love Oscar the Octopus! He's so adorable! Look at his cute little button eyes and aw, oh, he's so cute. I love to play with Oscar the Octopus. Molly, Mo you did take Oscar out of my room. You know you're not supposed to take toys out of my room. Give that to me. Daisy, no, I'm playing with this, but it's my toy. Okay, well, you can share. No, I can't, Molly, it's mine, mine, mine. Well, I think that it should be mine, mine, mine. Molly, this is my toy. You want to know what? You're so annoying as a big sister. Give it to me, Daisy. I want to play with it. No, you can't have it. Give it to me. <laughs> you can't catch me, Daisy. Yes, I can, Molly. Okay, well, I didn't even try to run that far. Oh, you're so frustrating. I didn't run that very far because I wanted to come back and play with this toy. You mean my toy, Molly. Okay, yeah, your toy, but you can't share it with me. No, sometimes I wish I was like Bucky Cookie, an only child. No, you don't, Daisy. You'd whiz me. Miss me. I mean, wish me. <laughs> I mean, miss me. You'd miss me. Whatever, Molly. No, I wouldn't. I wish I was an only child. Don't wish that, Daisy. Your wish might come true. Get out, Molly. I can't. You locked me inside. <laughs> Molly, I mean it, get out! <laughs> made you laugh, Daisy, made you laugh. No, you didn't! Ugh, sisters are annoying. Hey, where'd my sister go? She just, like, disappeared. Daisy? Daisy! She ran right past me. She's like a ghost. She ran right out of here. Daisy! Did she sneak in her closet? You're still here? Jeez! Get out! to go in here just to get some privacy. Pretend I'm an only child. Daisy, you don't wish that. Don't say it. It might come true. I wish it, Molly. I'm gonna say it. No, Daisy, don't say it. Get out of my closet, Molly. Okay, but don't say it, okay? I am going to say it. Here I go, Molly. You can't stop me. I wish... I never met you and you were my sister. I'm gonna go get in the hot tub. It's been a long day. Hey, wait a minute. Where's that door go to? Is it locked? No. Hey, I've never been in this room before. What's this room for? It's like, a, it's like for a little girl, but there's like unicorn posters and and toys and puppy posters and... A computer? I've never seen this room before. Why is there an extra room in my house? Okay, this is just weird. Is the rest of my house like normal? Yeah. Molly, what are you doing? Um, Mom, did you notice that there's an extra room in our house? Don't be ridiculous, Molly. There's not an extra room. Now, I heard that there's a new neighbor. Why don't you go say hi? It's a little girl and she probably could use a friend. Oh, okay. Still don't understand why there's an extra room in our house, though. 
Do 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 pop pop a do do. Oh, yeah, the lights are definitely on over here. Knock knock. Anybody home? Hello? Whoa, there's moving boxes in there. Who is it? Oh, hi. Hi, Molly. I'm your next door neighbor. Oh, hi. I'm Daisy. I just moved here. Daisy, huh? That's a really cool name. Just like the flower, right? My name is Daisy. Just like the flower. <laughs> you even made a song up about it. That's so cool. I think we're going to be bestest friends. You do? Really? I just met you. I'm not so sure. Yeah, we're going to be really cool friends. Um, I live next door, and we're going to go to the same school. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I just moved here, and I moved away from all of my friends, so I feel a little sad. Don't you worry about anything, Daisy. Um, my, my, my name is Molly, if I didn't tell you that already. No, I think you told me. <laughs> Oh, sorry. I'm just, I'm just like so excited because you can never have too many awesome friends. And you can't have too many best friends either. Well, actually, I think a best friend is just one person. Nope. To me, it's as many people as I want. I have lots of besties. Oh, that's nice. Well, I'm glad you came and said hi. Do you want a snack? Do I ever? Of course. Snacks are my favorite. Really? What's your favorite subject at school? Um, probably recess or lunch. <laughs> Here, we could have some grapes if you want. Okay, sounds good. Mm. This is delicious, Daisy. Thanks for being so nice to me. You're welcome. What a fun's full. Oh, I just realized I didn't shut the door. Oopsie. My mom always says, were you raised in a barn? Close that. <laughs> Molly. That's funny because I actually lived in a barn before. What? We're like the cows and stuff? No. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're best friends already. I can tell. I know, right? We should totally go play at your house. Okay, come on. I'll show it to you. My house is really small. It's okay. It doesn't matter if you have a big house or a little house. I'd still be your best friend. Oh, Molly, you make me so happy that you're my bestest friend. Yeah, me too. Come on, you can come into my room. Whoa, your house is huge. Whoa, we've got cookies. Do you want one? So, sure, I'd love one, Molly. Thanks. Mmm, delicious, huh? Totally. So, we go play in your room or in your backyard? Actually, um... We could go play in my room. I have to go to the bathroom first, though, so you can just check out my room. I'll be right there. Don't want to be stinky around my new friend. Okay, that's better. <laughs> Ooh, I love this toy. Really? That's Oscar the octopus. He's my, one of my favorite toys. Really? He's so cool. Can I borrow him? Um, well, since you're my bestie, yes, you can. Oh, you're the best friend ever, Marley. Thank you so much. You're welcome, Daisy. I love you. You're such a good person. I think you are too, Molly. Whoa, what just happened? Um, you wished and it came true? And we got a glimpse into an alternate universe. Whoa, and were we like best friends? Ah, ah that was so creepy. My sister was my best friend. <laughs> yeah, that was creepy. That obviously can't be the truth. Well, I just can't help but think that if you and I weren't sisters, we'd actually be... Oh, besties? Yeah, Molly, besties. Oh, that's laughable. Yeah, tell me about it. My sister, my best friend? I don't think so. Gotta go have a cookie when I think about that. Hey, um, were you girls just in here eating cookies? What? No, we weren't in here at all. Oh, well, there's cookies missing. That's strange. Oh, my gosh. Our alternate reality actually came true. What are you talking about? And where's your best friend, Daisy? Huh? What? You, what, what do you mean, my sister, Daisy? <laughs> you guys are so good of friends. I'm sure you'd like her to be your sister. But no, Molly, she's not. She's just our neighbor. But, uh, I, I, uh, uh, uh. Molly, what's wrong? The cat got your tongue? Oh, 
Oh my gosh. Daisy. Daisy, we have a problem. Daisy, where are you? Daisy? Daisy? Oh my gosh, where is Daisy? I don't know where. Molly, I'm in here washing my hands. Daisy, the alternate universe actually came true. Oh, whatever, Molly. No, you have to wish. You have to wish that I was your sister. No, I no way. I'm not doing that. You have to, Daisy, because Mom doesn't know that you're my sister. Whatever, Molly. Quit pranking me. I'm going out into the kitchen to see for myself. I'm telling you the truth, Daisy. Oh, hey, Molly. Don't forget you have to do your chores, and that will mean your friend Daisy has to go home. What? But I. But you're my mom. Oh, honey, I'm not your mom. I'm sorry. Do you not have a mommy? No, but I have a mommy and a daddy. Oh, that's good. Mom, um, something really weird is going on here. We'll be right back. Oh, well, don't forget your chores so your friend has to go home. Uh-huh, sure. Uh, sure, Mom. Daisy, come on. You're right, Molly. She doesn't know. It's like the alternate universe came true. That's why you have to say, Daisy, I wish... That you were my sister with all my heart. Oh, do I have to? Yes, Daisy, you have to. Okay, jeez. I wish Molly was my sister with all my heart. Daisy, I don't think anything happened. Well, maybe we don't feel it when it goes back to normal. Well, you're so annoying. Why can't you, why can't you just wish the right way? Molly, I did wish the right way. Oh, I need a cookie. Girls, come on. You need to do your chores. I thought Daisy had to go home. What are you talking about, Molly? This is her home. Ooh, look, it worked. No thanks to you, Daisy. Oh, that was scary today. Well, you're an annoying sister. Yep, everything's back to normal. Hey, Toy Hero fans, it was a crazy day at my house, wasn't it, guys? Leave this video a huge thumbs up if you liked this video. And don't forget to subscribe to all four of our channels. The Toy Heroes, The Toy Heroes Games, Gaming with Daisy, and Gaming with Molly. Mmm, cookies. Baby Kira, don't eat all the cookies. I eat them all. I eat them all. Thanks so much, Luke, for inviting my sister and I over to play Roblox. Yeah, we love it so much. It's our favorite. Oh, he's playing Jailbreak. Ooh, Luke, this is one of my favorites. Ah, I can't believe it. I just got trapped by that cop. Don't worry, I know how to beat this game. Wait a minute, you lost the connection to the game? What's going on? <gasps> Molly, maybe the internet stopped. No, you guys are not allowed to play Roblox all day. But, but, Mom, it's it's my party. Yeah, it's his party. You are playing too much Roblox. What? There's no such thing as too much Roblox. Well, yeah, Molly, sometimes you have to go out and play. Yeah, but not at our party. Come on, can we play, please, please, please? Uh, no, you can't play. Ugh, you're a grumpy mom. Yeah, you're a grumpy mom. Come on, everybody, let's get out of here. We can go to my house and play. I don't think so. I've set up a bunch of booby traps so you can't get out. What? You really are a grumpy mom. Okay, I've got to get through these booby traps and get to my house. Ah, what? I died already? Yeah, watch out for that lava, Molly. It's a real killer. <laughs> you can say that again. Come on, party attendees. Come to my house where their Roblox never ends. Uh, this door is out of bounds. I think you should use the other door. Thanks, Luke. I'll try it. It worked. Oh, Daisy. Bummer, you died. Oh, I got two right and one wrong. There's microphones in here. This is so she can hear what we're saying. Okay, Daisy, come this way. This way. And then over here, I think. Oh, no. It's the one all the way to the right, Daisy. Thank you, Molly. You're welcome. Now you don't have to die. You're so lucky. You're so lucky to have a nice sister like me, aren't you? I guess, Molly. You guess? Oh, no. Not another locked door. Okay, how about this one? Come on, party attendees. Follow me. Whoa, Molly. Look at 
and these old TVs. This is what the dinosaurs used to play Roblox on. Daisy! We didn't have Roblox when dinosaurs were around. Ooh, look at these pretty flowers! Don't be tricked! There's probably one that's booby-trapped. You're probably right, Marty. You're probably right. Escaping the grumpy mom. We're gonna have to go into the cave. A cave? Um, this sounds like a bad idea. Yep, there's lava down here. Whoa, I almost fell in it. It melted the end of my shoe. Marty, stop jumping by me. Well, I'm trying to jump by you because I've got to escape. Duh. Uh-oh, that guy just died. Don't worry, Marley. I'm sure he'll make it to our party eventually. I hope we have enough snacks for everybody at our house since we weren't expecting all these people to come over. Me too. I mean, what did his mom expect us to do? Of course we're going to play Roblox. Oh my gosh, I just exploded. Did you see that? Yeah, Marley, that was crazy. Um, I don't get it. Oh, you just pushed me into some lava. It wasn't very nice, was it? Okay, Daisy made it. Maybe... Okay, I don't get it, Daisy. Go to the end and try to get over. I tried that already. It didn't work. See, I just keep dying. Good job, Marley. You will my still. Almost. But almost doesn't count. And this other party goer is like jumping right so close behind me. Go. Just go because... Every time you jump... Every time I jump, you jump. And then I just... I feel like you're going to push me into the lava. <laughs> See, I just died. Molly, that had nothing to do with him. Don't even blame anybody else. Okay, okay. Wait a minute. Which way do I go? This way, Molly. I love Roblox. Yes, I do. I love Roblox. How about you? Do, do, do. I love Roblox. Yes, I do. I love Roblox. How about you? If you love Roblox, slam that like button. Come on. Sparkles the unicorn said to do it. <laughs> I bet she did, Molly. Um, where is this? Oh, this way, Daisy. Okay, no, never mind. Oh, no, there's a ton of people in here. You know what that's going to mean? What, Molly? It's going to mean everybody's in here and they're trapped. I am so confused. How do I get out of here right now? This way, everybody! Just everything looks the same. Ugh, I don't like it. It's too close in here. Do, 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 do. Yes, I made it! Okay, um, don't touch the steam. Good idea. Thanks, Luke. If it wasn't for you, Luke, man, we'd Oh, my goodness, someone didn't follow instructions. You've got to follow instructions, people! Follow instructions. Okay, somehow I got to get up onto this ladder. Okay, uh, what? I died? On what? Just, I don't know, Marty. You hit your head on the ladder, I guess. Oh, now I gotta go through the steam all over again. Someone else died, too. Oh, tragedy. Tragedy! I think my unicorn's too fat. That's why we can't get through here. It's all your fault, unicorn! For some reason, I can't jump up onto this ladder. I don't know why, and it killed me when I tried. See? Okay, I jumped up there, and it di I died. That doesn't even make any sense right now. Back to the steam, I go. Okay, I don't get this part! Why is this doing this to me? Okay, I died again. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna need to say Power of the Unicorn. Are you ready, guys? Power of the Unicorn with a sparkly horn. Okay, Unicorn, time to earn your keep. Not be a lazy unicorn. You already ate three of my math assignments. You didn't even help me! Man, this grumpy mom sure did set up a lot of booby traps. <sighs> I'm really in the mood for pizza, too. And basically, um, there's no pizza down here. <laughs> Pizza! Guys, if you could leave me a pizza emoji in the comment section below, it would be amazing. I might need it to get through this part of Roblox. Oh my gosh, finally! Oh, thank goodness. Finally, Molly, I thought it was going to take you all day. Oh, 
Oh, and then you died in the slime? Seriously? Oh, I'm having a really bad day. This was supposed to be an amazing party, but here I am. Stuck with these booby traps from Grumpy Mom. Everybody get grumpy. Yeah, but not everybody sets up a bunch of booby traps. With slime in the bottom. I kind of like slime. It's like ooey and gooey and super gross. Um, whoops, I went the wrong way. You like slime? Yeah, but not this slime. This slime is deadly. This slime is poisonous. Oh, no, it was on the stair! Come on, Molly, we don't have a day. We're gonna eat pizza and play Roblox. I'm trying, okay? My unicorn's being lazy again. Molly, you know how to play Roblox. You don't need your unicorn. No, I always need my unicorn. Always! Isn't that right, Sparkles? Don't listen to her. Um, Molly, what's good? God! Oh, we got eaten. We got eaten by Grumpy Mom. Ew, we've been eaten. Yeah, your mom is just having a really bad day. No wonder she didn't even get a cupcake today. I'd have a bad day too. Ah! I just died in stomach acid. Gross! Me too, Molly. Me too. That part's really hard. Yeah, because there's lasers above you, and then that... Um, steak is like going sideways, so you can't even see where you're supposed to be going. I'll jump on the chicken leg. Don't touch the lasers. Okay, yes, I did it! Woohoo! Oh gosh, I don't like what's gonna happen next, Daisy. What do you think, Molly? I think that's gonna be gross! Okay, I keep falling. Boing. Boing. <laughs> oh my gosh. There's so many ledges. Ah, I'm getting dizzy. Why is there so many ledges? Stop it. Stop it. Ew! It's poo poo. Why is there poo poo down here? You know why, Molly. You know why. I don't, I don't, I've got to close my eyes. I can't even look. Ew, gross. Did I make it? Yeah, Molly, you made it. Whoa! Oh my gosh, my unicorn. Are you okay? Your unicorn's okay, Molly. Hey, why are you, why are you, like, falling on me? I can't help it. It's a conveyor belt of death. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I don't know where we are. Ew! <laughs> Gross. We're in the toilet. <laughs> Ew, we're in toilet water. Ew. I'm totally going to need a bath before this party now. Oh, nice. You found a leak in the toilet. Yeah, gross. Thanks for us inviting us to your party. Um, that was super great. You're small enough to fit under that door. Go, go, go. Oh, my gosh. Are we out yet? Go through that mouse uh, hole over there. It'll take you right outside. Here's hoping, Molly. Here's hoping. Tell me about it, Daisy. Oh, Ugh. Ugh, I ran into the wall. Ah! Almost there. Almost there. Molly, there's giant mice right here. You don't touch their tails. They are not friendly mice. How do you know? Maybe they'll feel we friendly. Trust me, giant mice, not friendly. If I was a giant mouse, I'd be friendly. Oh, yeah? Well, these ones aren't. Look at Oh, I guess you gotta jump on the cheese. The cheese stands alone. The cheese stands alone. Oh, my gosh. I've got a cheese stands alone. Molly, that doesn't even make sense. <laughs> Who said all my songs have to make sense? Oh, bloodle. We gotta jump on this little cheese. Oh! Molly, I'm leaving! Daisy, you better not leave me here with these giant cheeses. This one smells like stinky feet. That would be you, Molly. You should probably take a bath. Oh, ha ha, Daisy! Ha ha! Do you guys have a sibling? Do you guys, um, drive each other nuts? My sister drives me crazy. Molly, that's not nice. Hey, look at look, I see the outside! Yeah! Molly, look at that, we can have a party! Ugh, okay, fine, you win! Just let me out, out of here and have some cake. <laughs> I don't think so, lady. <laughs> hey guys, thanks so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you can be one of our number one fans. And leave us a comment too to tell us how much you like this video. Okay, guys, we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye, guys!
What time is it? 1.30 in the morning? Molly, what are you doing out of bed? It, it's the middle of the night. Mom, I am starving. And since it's officially Saturday morning, could I have some cereal, please? Sure, Molly, but then right back to bed, okay? Okay, Mom. Can't believe you woke up in the middle of the night, Molly. Yeah, me either. But my stomach was like, growl, growl, growl. What kind of cereal do we have? I don't see any cereal. Oh my gosh, are we out of cereal? It's okay, I'll have some black tarts. Those are delicious. Besides cereal, they're one of my favorite snacks. My mom doesn't let me eat them for breakfast very often. She usually makes me eat something really healthy. But right now, she said I could have cereal, so... That's what I'm gonna have. Well, actually, I'm gonna have black starts, but that's only because we didn't have cereal. <laughs> they're really, really good. Mm. <sighs> now that my stomach is full, maybe I can go back to sleep. <laughs> Can't believe it woke me up at 1.30 in the morning. How ridiculous. <laughs> It's um, time to wake up, rise and shine, bright and early on this Saturday morning. <laughs> Molly, quit snoring and wake up, wake up, wake up! Huh? What? what? Why are you jumping at me, Daisy? Ugh, why are you waking me up so early? It's like 5.30 in the morning, what are you, crazy? Molly, we have to wake up this well early. There's a new episode of the Brandy Colored Unicorn on. Yeah, in like two hours. But Marty, we have to do our chores and then we have to eat breakfast. Daisy, I woke up at 1.30 in the morning. I'm going back to bed. Marty, why did you wake up at 1.30 in the morning? I don't know, my stomach was telling me, get out of bed, you're super hungry. <sighs> Marty, if you miss the brightly colored unicorn, you're never gonna forgive yourself. <sighs> okay, Daisy, come on. Oh, wait, I forgot. I have to get what my chores are. Okay, here we go. I'm half asleep right now, but I guess I'll get my laundry. Ugh, there's so many this week. Ugh. Let's see, what should I have for breakfast? Anything I want, because it's Saturday, Saturday, Saturday. Ugh, she is such a morning person. I am not a morning person, especially when I wake up hungry at 1.30 in the morning. Uh, and then I was awake till like 2.30 eating a black star. Oh my gosh. It was craziness. Molly, what do you want for breakfast? I can make you something. I don't care. I just want you back to bed, honestly. Uh, so tired. Well, at least all of your laundry and your chores will be done early. Yeah, I guess that's... Totally awesome, I suppose. <laughs> Molly, you never did like doing your chores, did you? Um, that would be right. I never did. <laughs> Who likes doing their chores? I love doing my chores, Molly. Um, Mom's not even awake yet, Daisy, and you're already awake. I know. I love getting an early start to my day. Ugh, <sighs> sisters, they can be so annoying. I'm not annoying, Molly. I'm just helping you to help you. What? You're helping me to help me? Yeah, exactly. Helping you help you. Ooh, what are we having? We are having pancakes. Ooh, that sounds delicious. We are the only ones awake right now. That means no one will bug us when we're watching Barley Colored Unicorn. I did a bunch of potatoes your diaper. Ah, yeah. Mom usually takes care of your diaper, baby Kira. And what were you saying? I take all the pancakes right away. What? Take all the pancakes and run away? Baby Kira, come back here, baby Kira. Mmm, yeah. Baby Kira, give me those. You naughty little baby, you. I eat all the pancakes. Oh, my gosh. I tried to get up early so that everybody would be quiet turning brightly colored unicorn, but no. Ah, I just need some orange juice. I had all those black tarts at like 2 a.m., so I'm pretty good. <laughs> ah, some refreshing orange juice. Oh my gosh, baby Kira's gonna freak out. I 
Unless I get her her bottle. Fine. Okay. Go to work. No, it's Saturday. What are you, crazy? Oh, good morning, girls. Oh, thanks, Daisy, for making the pancakes. Whoa, Mom, you look really tired. That's because, well, Molly woke me up first, and then baby Kira woke me up half the night. Oh, she was awake all night long, and it was, like, so awful. Oh, oh. Wow, Mom, that sounds terrible. Yeah, but I still love her, even though she kept me up all night, and I'm so tired. I need coffee. Well, Mom, we can watch baby Kira. Molly, no, we can't. We're going to watch our new episode of the Boily Colored Unicorn, duh. Yeah, but she'll watch it. Yeah, loudly. I just have to tell Papa. I just have to tell my Papa. Yeah, that's your Baba. Oh, thanks, girls, for offering to watch baby Kira while I go back to sleep. Wow, Mom, you really are tired. She must have kept you up all night. Okay, everybody be quiet. The new episode of Brightly Colored Unicorn is about to come on. Oh my gosh. Baby Kira, you're sitting in my spot. Okay, never mind. I'll just sit over here. Wait for me. Uh, Daisy, you better hurry up. It's about to start. It's starting, Daisy. The Brightly Colored Unicorn. The Brightly Colored Unicorn. OMG, a new episode. This is going to be the best devil. What? What? Why are you crying? Don't cry. We're trying to watch this episode. I just bet you can't do the day. We'll go outside. She wants to go outside, Molly. No, we're going to watch the brightly colored unicorn. Doesn't that sound fun? No. I just bet you Oh, no. You have to watch her, Molly. Oh. Okay, well, maybe I could just, like, kick her out. Molly! <laughs> just kidding. Well, I guess we're gonna have to watch the rerun. Come on, baby Kira. I can go outside. I go outside. Yeah, you can go outside. Come on. Okay, it takes her forever to crawl across the floor. I can't be done. I can't Have fun outside. I'm watching Pearly Colored Unicorn. Uh huh, sure. I've gotta do all the work around here. Okay, I'll push you, baby Kira. Ooh, Saturday. Yep, Saturday's pretty awesome, isn't it? Even if your baby sister has kept your mom awake all night and so you have to babysit her doing your brand new episode of the Brother of the Colored Unicorn. <sighs> we love you, sissy. Oh, I love you too, sissy. Oh, you're so adorable, baby Kira. I did the boy, I thank you, Papa. Welcome to your first night shift at the toy shop. It's your job as a security guard to make sure no one robs the place. If you hear any noises, go check it out. Also, make sure to keep the power off as it can cause, well, um, uh, problems. Have a nice day. I think this is going to be pretty easy. Well, Molly, what? why are you so tall? <laughs> I guess I had a growth spurt or something. Like guacamole, you'd like a giant. <laughs> I can't believe we got a job as um, security guards at a toy shop. This is so cool. Yeah, but look at that guy over there. He's really creepy. Mr. Funny Dunny, Dummy, I can talk. Well, he is a little creepy. I'd much rather have a teddy bear. Too bad. I'm getting you a Mr. Funny Dummy. <laughs> That's what you're getting for Valentine's Day. You better not. Molly, seriously, sorry, I was a little distracted. You're so tall. Yeah, get over it. You're short. I'm I'm tall, and you're not. Oh, rude. All right, let's go into the staff only um section because I'm sure there's treats in there. Molly, they don't give you treats. It's pretty dark in here. I can use my flashlight if you want. That's a great idea. This place is a little creepy. Um, so, uh, I don't see any of the treats. Molly, just because you got a job here doesn't mean they're going to give you treats. Oh, that seems kind of, like, rude. There, I turned on the power. Now it won't be so creepy. And maybe we can find the cupcakes. Molly, when they give you a job somewhere, they don't give you snacks. Well, 
What do they expect from me then? They're gonna give you money for working here. Wait, what, 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 what was that? It sounded like it came from the shop floor. I don't know. We probably should go check it out. Maybe they're dropping off the cupcakes. Wait. Where, 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 where did Mr. Funny Dummy go? What are you talking about? He's right there. <gasps> that giant dummy is gone! I know, Molly. It, it's sort of creeping me out a little bit. Oh, I'm sure somebody just moved it. Probably as a prank. I don't know, Molly. That guy was really weird. Hey, look. We can go up here. Daisy, come on. Let's, let's go up here. Molly, we can't reach. We're not tall enough. Well, somebody stand here and I'll jump on their head. Okay. Uh, okay, that didn't work. Okay, Daisy. Um, we can't go up there. No kidding, Molly. Oh, wow. If you go through here... Ow, it hurts! Be careful, Molly. Be careful. It's sort of like an abbey. Whoa. This job got way more serious all of a sudden. Where is my cupcakes? Oh, boy, Molly. You really don't get it, do you? You can buy your own cupcakes with the money they pay you. Yeah, that's probably true. Pull lever. Molly, that dummy is going to show up here. I just know it. Molly, hurry! That lever made platforms. And if you don't, you don't jump on them, you die. Well, I made it. <laughs> Which is surprising because usually when I play games like this, all I do is spend all of my Robux. Funny game one? I don't know if I, I think this game is funny at all. What happened to the lights? I, I hear something in the distance. I don't know, Molly, but I think there's only one way out, so we probably should go look. Um, I'm going this way with my sister. <laughs> you guys can go that way. Molly, do you think Mr. Funny is in the shadows? Daisy, why are you so paranoid about Mr. Funny? Because this was called Mr. Funny's toy shop. Oh yeah, this probably does have something to do with that giant creepy toy dummy. Absolutely, Molly. This is like a maze. You can never get out of it. I'm going to get out of it. I'm smarter than Mr. <laughs> Funny. Ah! 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 That creeped me out! Holy guacamole! That was terrifying! I wasn't expecting that! Oh my god! Ah, that gave me a heart attack! <laughs> Molly! Did Mr. Funny get you? Yeah, it wasn't funny at all! It was terrifying! I was like, who's that behind me? And when I turned around, it was Mr. <laughs> ah! There he is again! Okay, this is creeping me out. <laughs> okay, I can tell already I'm not going to get past game one. Maybe if I just keep running super fast. <laughs> I don't think I can yell. Ah, there he is again! Ah! <laughs> oh my god. I keep screaming because it just creeps me out. Okay, guys, if this game creeped you out, let me know in the comment section below. Maybe if I don't turn on my flashlight, he won't get me. Maybe he's attracted to the light. Oh my god! Oh my god, I can run faster than him, right? Ah! Mr. Funny, stop it. We can be friends. I mean it, we can be friends. <laughs> he moves. So creepy! OMG! Why you following me, Mr. Funny? Oh, <laughs> I can't even talk right now. Oh my god, I just made it to the exit. Daisy! Molly! Close the door! Oh my gosh, did Mr. Funny get you a bunch of times? Yeah! <laughs> I literally almost had a heart attack. It was so scary. Guys, if you don't like jump scares, this is not the game for you. Okay, I'm going to go over here. I don't know where it goes, but... Oopsie! Not that way. Okay, let's see if we go up here. Oh, that looks like a way out, but we can't get over there. And then up here, and then here. Come on, Molly, you can do this! And then up here, yes! Oh, thank goodness, Molly. I thought I was going to lose you to Mr. Funny forever. He is not funny. There is nothing funny about Mr. Funny. Agreed! Ah! Oh, man! Daisy, I just, I just died in the most horrible way. I see that, Molly. Definitely don't go down there. Oh, no, I'm going to do it again. Oh, I got smushed by the rollers. Mr. Funny's toy shop is not funny. It's terrifying, actually. Oh, God. No. Molly, you didn't even make it to Funny Game 2. I, I don't think I want to. I think, I think, no. I'm thinking no. Whoa. 
Yes, I finally made it. Nope, just kidding. I died. <laughs> Molly! <laughs> Seriously? You stink. Yeah, a little bit. I think it's because I'm just like, I got really frazzled when I saw Mr. Funny or whatever his name is. Because he is creepy times a million. I couldn't agree more, Molly. He is pretty creepy. Oh, you finally made it. Um, Daisy, does this look like red light, green light to you? It does, Molly. It does. This is the game of red light, green light? Yeah, Molly. So when he's not looking, run! Oh, Daisy, you got eliminated. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if I want to get to the other side. He's so creepy. <laughs> Take that, Mr. Funny. <laughs> ah! He got me again! Ah! <laughs> His face is so creepy. Oh, man. <laughs> Okay, I'm, I'm just, I'm, I need a cupcake. <laughs> Is Daisy back? I don't, I don't know if that's Daisy over there. I'm not moving. I'm not moving till that head turns all the way around. Great. Ah! Why do you keep getting me, Mr. Funny? Molly, everything's gonna be okay. Just try your best. Would you like to buy a ninja star? I think I really would. I'm gonna stop way ahead of time, so that way, like right now, so that way I don't get killed because I don't know about you, but I cannot see Mr. Funny's face again. Whoa. He's going to give me nightmares, Mr. Funny. Perfect. Ah, don't get me. Oh, oh, that was a close one. Molly, I'm over here. Oh, Daisy. Oh, I'm so glad to see you made it. Yeah. I was really, really scared when Mr. Funny's face was, like, right up in mine. Holy guacamole. Ha ha! Can we move now? Yeah, Molly, he can't get you. Um, Mr. Funny, you are creepy. I can't even talk when I say that. It's gonna be okay, Molly. I never knew you to be so afraid of a game before. Well, this one's no ordinary game. Okay, I think if we go over here, and then, Molly, this way, I can help you if you want. Um, like this, and then, totally did it! Okay, press for the elevator. Here we go, Molly! Do you think Mr. Funny's gonna be up here? Absolutely. Okay, I'm just gonna hide inside this box then, forever. Molly, I still see you, um, oh, sorry. I'm hiding forever. Molly, I still see your other arm. That box isn't big enough for you. Oh, Mr. Funny's game number three. Oh, looks like a survival game. I'll have to avoid the giant robot by climbing on those blocks. Giant robot? What are they talking about? I don't see a giant robot. Um, Molly, just be careful. Get to a safe place in nine seconds. Okay, I have to say that this is a really inventive game. It's also scaring me to death, so... Okay, this is as high as I can... Oh my god! It's a Mr. Funny Robot! Uh-oh, am I up high enough? I hope so. Oh boy, he's knocking everything over. Oh no, this is gonna be bad, Daisy. This is gonna be bad. He is evil! Mr. Robot. Ah! Oh my gosh! He just took my head off! Okay, I've got to get somewhere where he's not going to break down the blocks. I think Daisy already made it through. She's so lucky. I'm the only one that's left here with that creepy... Oh my god, I only have one second and he's coming out here! Oh boy. Oh boy, I'm dying. I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die! That's what I needed to say to myself. Hey, Mr. Funny. This isn't funny. Oh man, I need to survive for 29 more seconds? Just, just leave me alone! You don't have to do this! You don't have to be this mean! Oh my god. Ah, we gotta run fast. Oh, Mr. Funny's closing in. Uh-oh, he ran me over. <laughs> Oopsie. Oh. Okay, it's saying I have to wait. I can buy a jetpack. That might be worth my money, actually. Just so I can escape Mr. Funny. If you guys haven't played this game yet, I highly recommend it. It is um, creepy, but very fun. Oh my god, no, don't let me fall! 
Oh! When I said it was really fun, it's also a little frustrating because when Mr. Funny tries to kill you, um, he succeeds. <laughs> Maybe he won't know I'm over here. Yeah, that's a good plan. I'll hide on Mr. Funny. Uh -huh. da -da 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 -da. He doesn't know where I am. Ha 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 ha, Mr. Funny. Do you think it's funny that I, I'm hiding from you? <laughs> okay, at least he can't squish me over here. Oh my god, I only have to make it 50 more in seconds. 12, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, I died at the last second. Are you serious right now? All right, one last attempt, guys. I think I can actually do it this time. I'm hoping. All right, I'm going to go over here. Um, I'm actually just going to hide. So what I'm going to do. I'm going to hide from Mr. Funny. See, there's Mr. Funny. And he knows exactly where I am, but I don't know how. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm going to die. Why me? Why me? Where is he? Oh, there's a lot of people in here right now. So they're just like trying to escape Mr. Funny too. Oh my god, it's not funny. It's not funny anymore, Mr. Funny. You're not funny. You're not funny even a little. Okay, now they're going over that way. Oh, please, please don't catch up with me. There's the exit. OMG, I might actually exit. You survived. <laughs> Marley, finally. Are you ready for the next part? Ah, why'd you push me, Daisy? Sorry. Ah! Ah, ah. Is this the exit? Please let it be the exit. Please. No way of knowing, Molly. But there's only one way to find out. It looks like... A really dark warehouse? This would be a good time to use my flashlight. Oh no, we're still not out of here. Molly, um, I think we're going to be stuck. Forever, there's Mr. Funny! <laughs> ah! Laura, roll over. You're snoring so loud. Huh? What? Uh, sorry. Laura, seriously, why are you snoring so loud? Ugh, I never met a girl who could snore as loud as you can. Ugh, sorry. Ugh, my stomach is just really hurting. Oh, you probably have to fart. Just go back to sleep. Oh, I think I have to go to the bathroom. Ugh, I don't feel so good. Oh, I hope you're going to be okay. Thanks, Dan. Ugh. Ugh, I'm definitely going to throw up. Ugh. Blech. Oh, gross! I hate throwing up! Oh, I don't feel so good. Laura, are you okay in there? Are you throwing up? Oh, she definitely got the stomach bug. Gross! Laura, it's okay. I'll bring you the Pepto-Bismol. Poor thing. Aw, I'll be right there. I mixed it with some ice cream so it tastes better, because Pepto-Bismol tastes awful. Laura, can I come in? Okay, you didn't answer. Here I come. <laughs> Laura? Oh my gosh, what happened? Laura? Are you alive? Ah! Uh... Okay, yeah, she's alive. She's moaning. Oh my gosh, she fainted. Okay, I'm calling 911. 911, what's your emergency? My wife, she was puking a lot, and I went to make her an ice cream pe Pepto Bismol smoothie, and when I came back, she was laying on the floor. She had passed out. I thought she was dead, but no, she moaned, so she's not dead. Okay, first of all, you should never feed someone ice cream and Pepto-Bismol when they don't feel good. Okay, yeah, but who cares about that? Second of all, I have dispatched a ambulance to your house. We know exactly where your cell phone location is. <laughs> it's so crazy, right? Technology. Are you going to be here soon? I'm really worried. Yes, we'll be there soon. Laura, everything's going to be okay, I promise. The paramedics are on their way. Uh... uh, uh, uh. I think she may have thrown up way too many times. I'm not really sure, though, what's going on. I hope she doesn't die. I love her a whole lot. Except for when she snores so bad in bed. 
Okay, sir, everything's gonna be fine. Hello, paramedic! Oh my gosh, you guys got here so quick! Oh my, okay, let's see what the trouble is. Ma'am, can you hear me? Ma'am? Oh, I can hear you. My stomach just hurts and then I got really dizzy. Oh, wow, ma'am. Well, I'm going to put you on the stretcher and take you in the ambulance to the hospital, okay? Do you remember your name? Yeah, it's Laura. Okay, Laura. Everything's going to be okay. All right, sir. Uh, you might want to get off the stretcher. Sorry, I'm just really nervous and kind of tired. I'll go out here and wait. Dan, why are you getting on my stretcher? Sorry. <laughs> Oops. All right, Laura. I'm just going to put you on the stretcher now. Everything's going to be okay. You're the nicest paramedic ever. Thank you so much. No problem, honey. Everything's going to be all right. Let's go get you into the ambulance. Would you like to come along, husband? Absolutely. Uh, I'll even go in my pajamas. I don't care. I don't know what happened. I, I was fine. I was sleeping and my husband woke me up and said, you're snoring too loud. And my stomach got upset and I ran into the bathroom to throw up and I fainted. It's okay, ma'am. We're going to take you to the hospital and they'll find out what's going on. We, we didn't pick up my husband. He'll have to meet us there. This is an emergency. Laura, are you still with me? Yeah, I'm just feeling really faint again. Oh, and my stomach really hurts. It's going to be okay, honey. I'm going to take good care of you. Come on. Let's get you, get you into a room so a doctor can see you. Hi there, Laura, is it? Yeah, I, I, I don't feel very good. Well, I'm Dr. Nickenbacher, and I will be taking care of you today. I just want my husband. Is he here yet? Uh, he should be on his way. I'm right here, honey. Sorry, you guys left without me. I just had to get my slippers. I came as soon as I could. I ran the whole way. You didn't take the car? Well, I mean, I ran to the car, and then I ran from the car to the emergency room door. That's what I bet. <laughs> I'm way too lazy to run all the way to the hospital. You know that. Yeah, I know. Oh, my stomach. Well, the first thing I think we should do with your wife is get an x-ray of her entire body because we have no idea what's going on most especially her brain and her stomach since she fainted and her stomach hurts that sounds like a good plan i'm so worried about her all right i'll send in a stretcher for you and i'll meet you in the x-ray room oh this won't hurt will it no x-rays are painless although they can be a little noisy how long will this take um, well, if I don't hit myself with the door, <laughs> about till right now. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay, wow. Um, that's an interesting find. What? What is it? Am I dying? I'm gonna send in the nurse to bring you back on the stretcher, and we'll have this conversation with your husband. Really? Really? I'm gonna die, aren't I? That's why he needs to be there. Uh, I wouldn't say that. I'll see you back in your room, Laura. What is it? What's happening? Let's wait for your wife to get back. This is the type of news I want to tell you together. Oh my god, she's dying! I knew it! Just calm down, Mr. Smith. Everything's going to be okay. Okay, Mr. and Mrs. Smith, I reviewed your wife's x-rays, and this is going to come as a bit of a shock to you. I knew it! She's dying! I don't know how I'll ever say goodbye to you, Dan. Okay, Mr. and Mrs. Dramatic, she's not dying. She's actually, well... Pregnant. Wait, what? Pregnant? Oh my gosh, I can't believe it! This is a little shocking and crazy. Yeah, and the crazy part is, is you guys are having, um, triplets. Triplets? What? Oh. Mr. Smith? Now you're the one that fainted. Mr. Smith, are you okay? Okay. I just need a minute here on the floor to just catch my breath. Okay. Are you okay, Mrs. Smith? I... I can't believe it. Pregnant with triplets? When... When am I due? When am I going to have my baby? Babies? <laughs> I mean, I still have to have, like, a baby shower and get cribs and... Well, that's just the thing. I've never seen this before in my career as a doctor, but... You're going to give birth any minute. Wait, what? Okay, I'm just going to stay down here on the floor because I can't move. I... Ah. Dan, I need your support. I can't believe it. I'm going to... Ah, my stomach hurts. Ah. Okay, honey. 
we got this. I mean, right? We do have this, right? You guys totally got it. Let me go put my iPad down. Sounds like I'm going to deliver three little babies. I've never seen this in my career before. This is going to be crazy. All right, let me change into my scrubs. What an amazing day this is going to be. Okay, let's do this. Wait, you you already had one of the babies? Yeah. Oh my gosh, it was crazy. Oh, you didn't wait for me. Oh, I wanted to deliver the baby. Okay, well, she had one. What do you want me to say? Oh, but here comes another. Here, Dan, hold the first baby. What am I supposed to do with it? Just be nice to her while I deliver baby number two. Okay, Laura, deep breath. Doctor, why are you laying down? Sorry, it's been a long shift. I didn't mean to lay down. Are you sleeping standing up? I don't know if I really am okay with you delivering these babies right now. You're being a little crazy. Oh, I'm sorry. Let me just lay down for a minute. Okay, I'm good. I took a one minute nap, so I'm fine. All right, let's deliver that second baby. Great job, Laura. She's beautiful. Okay, choose enough. We don't need the third one. She, can, she doesn't have to come. She can stay. Sorry, that's not the way it works, Mr. Smith. You're having three babies. Oh, she's adorable. Hi, sweet little girl. I know. Mine's adorable, too. They're both adorable, and we still have one more. I'm going to be poor. I'm totally going to be poor. Three girls? Trips to the malls? Oh, my gosh. I'm done for. Hi, Dr. Nickenbacker. What can I do for you? Whoa! You have twins? No, identical triplets. Oh my gosh! Okay, take the second baby because Laura's about to have the third. Okay, no problem. All right, Laura, deep breath. Are you seriously laying down again? Sorry, I'm just really tired. This is like a lot of excitement. I am a really good doctor though, I promise. Well then stand up and help me give birth to this baby! Okay, yeah, yeah, sorry. All right, you're doing great, Laura. Oh my gosh, honey. You had three babies! Get out of my bed, Dr. Knickerbocker! <sighs> okay, well, my shift's just about over, and these babies look adorable and healthy. Congratulations! Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Today has been the craziest day of my entire existence. Tell me about it, but look at our adorable babies. Oh, so sweet! Now all we have to decide is what we're going to name them. Hey guys, if you have names that would be perfect for our trip list, let us know in the comment section below because Laura and I have to come up with three adorable names for our sweet little girls. And we want to know what you guys would name your triplets. Okay guys, thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye guys! Oh, it's been such a long day. But look at the beautiful babies I got out of it. <laughs> I'm so happy. How to train a puppy. Go. No, no, no. Oh, a mastiff. That's a huge dog. Holy guacamole. Looks like they're walking a horse. <laughs> Molly, I'm here. Brookie, hey. Hey, Molly. I'm so excited about this special sleepover. So what makes it so special? <laughs> You're about to find out. What are you looking at on your iPad? Oh, nothing. It's all a part of the surprise. Whoa, <laughs> you packed a huge bag. Are you staying for a week or a night? Just a night. My mom says I have to be home in the morning. We're all going for a family breakfast. Whoa, cool. That sounds fun. So come on, I want to know what this amazing sleepover is about. Come on, I'm so excited. Okay, well, here goes. <whistles> uh, Molly, why are you whistling like that? Here, Oreo! Here, here, Oreo! Who's Oreo? Wait a minute. You're calling to the cookies down in the refrigerator? Molly, you might have a problem. <laughs> no, no, no. Oreo is my adorable puppy! What? You got a puppy? Oh my gosh! He's adorable! Hi! His name's Oreo? Yep, his name is Oreo. He hasn't really left my side. Well... Except for just now, because I was hiding him so I could surprise you. 
Oh my gosh, I've always wanted a puppy. He's so adorable, Molly. Ugh, it's not fair. How come you got a puppy and I didn't? Wait, what? You, you aren't happy for me? I'm trying to be happy for you, but it's just not fair. I mean, you don't even do your homework. You got a puppy and I always do my homework. I didn't get a puppy. I can't believe you're saying this to me right now, Brookie. I mean, you just seem like really sour grapes. Sour grapes, what does that mean? It means you're jealous. Um, okay, yeah, I admit I'm jealous that you got a puppy and I didn't. I mean, look at my shirt. It's obvious I love dogs. Ruff, 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 ruff. I didn't even know you liked dogs. Oh, well, you can come hang out with Oreo anytime you want. Yeah, I, I guess you're right. Now, come on, let's enjoy the sleepover. No need to be jealous, Brookie. You're my bestie, and and I don't want you to be sad. Come visit Oreo anytime. Well, it's not the same as having my own dog, but yeah, okay. Ruff, 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 ruff. Oh, hi, little guy. Aren't you the sweetest? Yeah, he really is. Come here, Oreo. Come here, Oreo. Ruff, 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 ruff. Oh, Molly, he just seems to want to stay by my side. What? No, he's my dog. He should come over to me. Come here, Oreo. <laughs> uh, Molly, I'm sorry. He's just like, he's stuck to me like glue. He must really like you or something. Well, I am sort of the dog whisperer. <laughs> yeah, I can tell. Come on, let's go watch a movie. Oreo! <laughs> Come on, Oreo. Let's go. Oh my gosh, my dog is attached to Brookie's hip. Seriously. Sorry about that, Molly. I mean... Uh, I, I know Oreo's your dog, but he really just seems to like me. Hi! Is the sleepover started yet? Where's Oreo? Uh, he's like totally attached to Brookie Cookie for some reason. Maybe it's because... Whoa! Look at this! A wolf! Yeah, we're not watching that. Boring. What were you saying? I was saying maybe it's because Brookie Cookie is amazing and our dog just loves um, her. Yeah, that's true. Oh, Oreo. Wait, where do Oreo go? Oreo go? Uh, he likes to sleep under the couch when we're watching TV. He's kind of crazy like that. Who wants popcorn? Not me. I'm going to have a healthy snack. Not me. I'm going to have a healthy snack. <laughs> My sister's so boring. She eats the most boring snacks. <laughs> I like your song, Molly. I don't like it. Molly, that's rude. Sorry, but it's true. My sister's so boring. She eats the most boring snacks. <laughs> You're so silly, Molly. She's so annoying is more like it. Yep. But only to you, Daisy. Only to you. Ruff, ruff, ruff. Oh, sorry, Oreo. Here, I'll toss a few pieces of popcorn under the couch for you. Oh, that's so nice, Brookie. Ugh. That was a long movie, and ugh, I'm so full of popcorn and snacks. Molly, you're supposed to totally eat the popcorn slowly so it lasts through the whole movie. Nope, nope, didn't do it. Ugh, so full. Besides, the movie's over, so I guess I sort of accomplished that. No, you didn't, Molly. You ate all of your popcorn in the first 15 minutes. Then you went back for seconds and thirds and fifteenths. Yeah, which explains why my stomach hurts. <laughs> well, I have to go to bed kind of early tonight, Molly, because I'm having breakfast with my family in the morning, remember? Okay, yeah, come on. You can set up your sleeping bag in my room. Oreo! <laughs> come on, boy! Here, yeah, boy! Sorry, Oreo's just following me around again. Oreo, you're my dog! Apparently, Oreo's forgotten. Come on, Oreo, come on, come on! Oh, I think Oreo just wants to sleep on my bed in my sleeping bag. Fine, Oreo! Ugh, I feel like my dog likes you better than me! And I'm the dog's owner! Sorry, Molly, I told you dogs just really like me. And cats, and hamsters, and fish. <laughs> I'm sort of an animal whisperer. Fine! I mean, Oreo lives here, so I guess Brookie can sleep with him just one night. Where's Daisy? She's still brushing her teeth. She said she'll be up in a minute. Okay, fine. Well, good night, Oreo! <coughs> Seriously, my dog is already asleep? Ugh! The dog never falls asleep when it sleeps in my bed. It just whines all night long. 
Look at it all snuggled under the covers with Brookie. You think that dog was her dog. What's going on, Indale? What are you doing, Daisy? I just want to make sure you two aren't getting into a fight, and I was walking into the middle of it. No, we're not fighting. Then why do you seem so irritated, Molly? Because Oreo just wants to hang out with Brookie. Well, maybe Brookie should own Oreo. What? Don't say that. Rude. Ugh, sisters are so annoying. <laughs> Molly, Molly, hey, I've got to leave. Molly, can you hear me? Molly, Molly, I have to leave now. I have to meet my family for breakfast. Molly? <coughs> well, I guess I'll call her later. She's sleeping so peacefully, I won't bug her. <coughs> okay, I'll see you later, Oreo. Bye. She should have said bye, though. Yeah, she probably didn't want to wake us up. Yeah, true. Oreo! <whistles> Where'd Oreo go? Is he under the bed? No, I don't see him down there. He's probably downstairs waiting for breakfast. You're probably right. <laughs> He's just like me. He wants breakfast first thing in the morning. Oreo, where are you? Oh boy, this is going to be a deliciously healthy breakfast. A waffle with some banana. Oreo! Ore Oreo! Daisy, Oreo's not coming. That's weird. Oreo, are you in the washing machine? If you are, that's a terrible place to hide. You're going to get washed with the underwear. Um, Daisy, Oreo is nowhere. Check the bathroom, Molly. Maybe he had to go potty. Oh my gosh. My sister's ridiculous. She actually thinks dogs use the potty. Um, they go potty outside, Daisy. Ew, they do? Gross. <laughs> oh, boy. My sister's clueless when it comes to dogs. Where do you think Oreo is? I don't know. He's probably around here somewhere. Oreo! Oreo! <whistles> He's probably just sleeping somewhere here or hiding to be funny. But we're out of coffee, so I'm going down to Starbucks for a cup. Do you want anything? No. I'm just starting to get a little worried. Where could Oreo be? Maybe the door got open and he went outside. Ah! That's a horrible thought! Oreo? Oreo? Okay, he's not in the house. And, 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 and he might be in this entire huge town? Oh my gosh. Oreo! Oh, Oreo. Ruff, ruff. You're such a cute little dog. What? Brookie Cookie stole Oreo? Oh my gosh, I have to call my sister. <laughs> I know, Oreo. I'm sort of glad you're at Starbucks with me too. Although I'm sure Molly and Daisy miss you. Hey, Daisy, what is it? Molly, I, I have some news to tell you. What? Is it about Oreo? Did you find him? Yes, Molly, but it's bad news. Oh my God, what happened to Oreo? Molly, um... Someone stole him. I, I don't want to tell you who. You better tell me who, Daisy. I need to know so I can call the cops. It was... It was... Spit it out, Daisy! It was Brookie Cookie. W wait. W what? My best friend stole my dog? Molly, I think you better come down to Starbucks right away. I'll be there in a minute. Bye, Molly. Oh, boy. This is not going to be good. Not good at all. O-M-G, my sister was right. Brookie, you stole my dog. What? No, it's it's not like that, Molly. Ruff, 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 ruff. I, I promise. Well, if the shoe fits, wear it, princess. What? What are you talking about? I'm saying that you have my dog, and I've been looking for him all morning, and I couldn't find him, and I was scared. And here to come to find out... My best friend is having a latte with my puppy. I'm I'm sorry, Molly. It, it, it's not my fault. 
Yeah, you were so jealous I got a dog. You stole it. We can't be best friends anymore. I don't, I don't even care about you anymore. Molly, why would you say something so mean to me? <laughs> okay, well, that was a bit harsh, but why did you steal my dog? I have to call the cops. Molly, no, don't, don't call the cops. Oreo followed me home and I didn't know it. I, I, I'm just here to meet my family for breakfast. And, and as soon as breakfast was over, I was going to bring Oreo straight back to your house. I told you I was the dog whisperer. What? Oreo snuck out of the house and followed you here? Oreo, is that true? Woof, woof, woof. Oh my gosh, Brookie, I'm sorry I accused you. Oreo, don't you love me? Don't you want to live with me? Oh, that's not it at all, Molly. It's just Oreo heard I was going to Starbrook's, and what dog doesn't want to have a delicious muffin? Oreo, I would have bought you a muffin. Ruff, ruff, ruff. See, as soon as you mentioned that he could have a Starbucks muffin, he's back to being your dog. Oh, you little devil, you. Ruff, ruff. Brookie, are we okay? Sure we are, Molly, but try next time to not accuse me until you know. Okay, I promise. And thanks for watching out for Oreo. No problem, Molly. Have fun with your family. Come on, Oreo. Let's get a muffin. Or a cupcake. Or a donut. Which one do you want? Ruff, ruff, ruff! All three? <laughs> You're definitely my dog. Playtime songs. They're so awesome. All right, let me see if I can find another one. Molly, it's time to get ready for bed. What? No, I'm watching Poppy Playtime music. Molly, you've been watching that all night. Seriously, you have to go to bed now. But mom, there's this one about Huggy Wuggy. Molly, time for bed. Seriously. Okay, fine. How come Daisy gets to stay up late? Molly, Daisy's not even here. She's at dance camp. But I bet she's staying up late. Molly, I don't know if Daisy's staying up late, but you should have went to dance camp if you wanted to see if you could stay up late at dance camp. Uh, Mom, you're not making any sense right now. Molly, just go to bed! Okay, okay. Wow, you ever have your mom just get like so annoyed with you? <laughs> yeah, that happens to me too. Ah, well, I guess I am kind of tired. Yeah, but tomorrow night I'm staying up till midnight and watching all the Poppy Playtime songs. <laughs> huh? What? What was that sound? Dream? Huggy Wuggy! He's in my room! Molly, are, I think you're just sleepwalking. No, no I'm not! Huggy Wuggy's in my room! How do you know, Molly? Your eyes are still closed. <laughs> They're not closed! Okay, they were sort of closed, but Mom! Huggy Wuggy's in my room! Okay, Molly, okay, well, let's go look. I'm sure it was just a shadow or something. You go first. You're braver than me, and you're the grown-up. And plus, I don't want to get eaten by Huggy Wuggy. Molly? There's nothing in your room. But, 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 but he was right here! Maybe he's hiding on the side of the bed. He was on Daisy's bed? Yeah, maybe he wanted to have a sleepover or something. I don't know, but he was right here! And then and, and where's he hiding? Huggy Wuggy! Come out right now! Molly, I think you've been watching too much Poppy Playtime songs on YouTube. That's gonna be enough of that. What? No, I love those. You can't take those away from me. Well, Molly, it seems like you're having nightmares about it. No, I'm not. No, I'm not! No, I'm not! Oh, okay, Molly, I'm going back to bed. Try to get some rest, okay? Okay. Good night, Mom. I love you. Uh-huh. I love you, too. Less Poppy's Playtime! Ah, she doesn't know what she's talking about. Poppy Playtime is amazing. I'm just not going to fall asleep, like, ever again. I'm just going to lay here with my eyes open until the morning. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah. Okay. I can stay awake. 
Sure, totally. Who wants a hug? Huh? What? What? Do you want a hug? Molly, what are you screaming about, Molly? Are you serious? Ugh, I have to get up for work in the morning. He was even in the hallway, Mom. I was wide awake and I saw Huggy Wuggy. Molly, seriously, if you need to, just sleep in here. I need to get a good night's sleep. Okay, fine, but be careful. Huggy Wuggy might come in. I'll just lock the door, Molly, okay? Okay, Mom? Yes, Molly? Thanks for letting me sleep in here. It was really creepy in my room. No problem. Now go to sleep, please! Seriously, she's not allowed to watch Poppy Playtime anymore. Hi, hi, I know. Hi, I know you're here, Huggy. Molly, wake up. Huh? What? What? <laughs> Molly, wake up. Okay, I'm awake. I'm awake. Mom, I know you think I was just like watching too much Poppy Playtime and basically having nightmares, but I'm telling you, Huggy was in my room. Molly, I don't believe you. And I'm exhausted for work today. Fine. You don't believe me? I'll, I'll prove it to you. You wait and see, Mom! You wait and see! I know what I'll do. I'll get a Huggy Wuggy trap. Hi, welcome to Brookhaven Grocery. I don't really want to be here today, but it's a job, so here I am. Oh, <laughs> okay, well, sorry you don't like your job very much. It's okay. As soon as I get done with college, I won't be working here anymore. Is there anything I can help you find today? Yeah! You can help me find a Huggy Wuggy trap. <laughs> a Wuddy Wuddy trap? Huggy Wuggy! Wuddy Wuddy? Huggy Wuggy! Don't tell me you've never heard of him. I've never heard of him. You know, Huggy Wuggy! Huggy Wuggy was a blue fuzzy fuzzy. Sharp teeth, big hands, wasn't friendly, was he? Gotta play whack a Huggy Wuggy. Hit that red, pink, green, yellow, bluesy woozy. Say what? What are you even talking about? Wait, I'm not done! Huggy Wuggy got two sets of teethy winkies. Gonna chop you into bitsy witsy witsies. Give him a punchy wunchy. In the heady weddy weddy be weddy be weddy. What are you singing right now? It's 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 crazy. Okay, fine. Obviously, you don't know what Huggy Wuggy is. You don't sell the traps here. I'll just have to try to figure out what would trap Huggy Wuggy on my own. Hmm. If Huggy Wuggy is anything like me, he loves Doritos. I'm gonna need I'm gonna need a grocery cart right now. Okay, here we go. Um, Doritos. Yes, please. Um, uh, what are you doing? Get me out of this car right now. First you talk about this crazy Huggy Wuggy, and now you're pushing me around like I'm a baby? Well, get out of my car then. Good grief. Okay, and then, um, I like Reese's, so he probably likes that. Oh, Hershey bars. Yes, please. Um, pizza. Nah, I'm sure you wouldn't like pizza, but these things will definitely trap a Huggy Wuggy. This Hershey bar is delicious. Okay, Molly, stop eating it. You don't want to eat it. You got to use it as a trap for Huggy Wuggy. Okay, I'll just put this over on my dresser. And, ooh, here's an ice cream. Mm. No, that won't work. It'll melt. Um, so Doritos. Um, and also a Reese cup. Perfect. Um, Molly, what are you doing? Mom, are you okay? Uh, I worked a very long shift. I'm exhausted. Did you watch more of that Poppy Playtime today? No, I didn't have time. I was too busy. Okay. Oh, I'm going to bed. Make sure you brush your teeth. Okay, Mom. I will. Good night. I love you. Good night, Molly. Now it's time to trap a Huggy Wuggy. Ugh, I am feeling pretty sleepy. Ugh, I hope my trap works, though. I'm totally sleeping with the lights on, though. It's too creepy without him. I mean, Huggy Wuggy is an evil monster. Ugh.
<laughs> he wants a hug. Ooh, what's that smell? It smells delicious. <gasps> Candy, Doritos. I love all these things. Oh my gosh, I hear Huggy Buggy. My trap worked. Freeze, Huggy! Huh? What? What? I know, I've been gone! Yeah, red-handed! And guess what? I came prepared. I've got a taser! What? No! Oh, why are you chasing me? I just wanted to give you a hug. Mom! Mom! You stay there. What am I saying? He's tased. He can't move. Whoa, I went to the wrong room again. Mom! Mom, wake up! Wake up! Mom, are you okay? Are you alive? Mom? Huh? What? Long shift at work. Can't move. Mom, I tased Huggy Wuggy. He's in my room. Wait, what? Are you serious? Yeah! Come quick, Mom! Come quick! He's right here! He's right here! Wait, what? What is that? That? Uh, looks like that creepy Huggy Wuggy toy. Molly, is this what you're so afraid of? Maybe we should give him away to Goodwill. It wasn't a toy. He was real. He was big and he was eating Doritos. Molly, you have such a crazy imagination. Ugh, imagine if you use that imagination for homework. Homework. Mom, I'm telling the truth. He definitely was creepy and big and... Molly, I'm going to bed. You should do the same. I have worked a double shift today. Good night. Are you taking that toy, Mom? Be careful. Molly, everything's going to be fine. Okay, Mom. Seriously. Be careful, Mom. Be careful. I must not fall asleep. I can't fall asleep. Huggy Wuggy's still in my house, even if he was pretending to be just a normal toy. <laughs> Who wants a hug? What games do you guys want to play? How about, uh, I want to play Twister. No, I don't want to play Twister. Ah, oh, I'm kind of like tired today. You're tired? Why? Oh, never mind. It's kind of a secret. A secret, you say, huh? Yeah, I'm just like really tired and I'm just, I'm not in the mood to like do Twister or any game that involves me moving. Oh, okay. Well, what about Truth or Dare? Ooh, yeah, I second that. Okay, yeah, I'll play Truth or Dare. Okay, Brookie, well, you ask first. Molly, Truth or Dare? Um, Truth. Do you have a crush on Luke? Um, I don't know what you're talking about. She knows exactly what you're talking about, Buki. Look, her face is getting really red. She's really embarrassed. Molly, you have to answer the truth. Um, uh, uh, next question. Molly, it, you're going to lose the game. I don't care. I'm not answering it. Come on. I'm your best friend. You can tell me. I won't tell anyone. Okay, yes, I have a crush on Luke. Oh. Ah! about it Ugh. we are so never talking about this ever again why you don't want to talk about your crush come on molly yeah molly molly and luke sitting in a tree k-i-s-s-i-n-t first comes love then comes marriage then comes babies in the baby carriage daisy be quiet Okay, Jeepers, no need to get so mad about it. Okay, Brookie. Ugh, truth or dare? Hmm, truth didn't work out so well with you, Molly. <laughs> I think that I'm going to pick a dare. Perfect! I dare you to let me and Daisy use her shrinking potion that she made in her science lab to go inside your brain and see what you're thinking, especially since you said there was a secret. Wait, whoa. Daisy has a lab? Yeah, it was supposed to be a secret until Molly blah, 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 blabbed. Well, it's it's pretty cool, Daisy. Why do you want it to be a secret? Because I don't want anyone to know I'm doing science experiments. Duh! Oh, okay. Well, um, she knows now. Um, I'm your best friend. I won't tell anybody. And um, my second question is shrinking potion. Yeah, I made a shrinking potion. 
And it allows us to shrink down and go in your brain. You have to take it. You chose dare. But then you'll know everything I'm thinking. Um, not everything, but we will see some things. Are you going to lose the game? Or are you going to let us go inside your brain? Huh? 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 Okay. You can use the potion and go inside my brain. Whoa! This is going to be cray cray. I sort of just wanted to go inside Brookie's brain just so I could drink the shrinking potion. It's so delicious. Tastes like a shamrock shake from McDonald's. Well, I made it taste yummy because who wants to drink a yucky drink? <laughs> I feel like I'm shrinking. Is anything happening yet? No, Molly, nothing. Whoa, Daisy, you're shrinking really fast. Oh, my gosh. You weren't kidding. She did shrink. Oh, my gosh. I don't know about this, guys. Just hold still. You won't feel a thing. Right, Daisy? I don't really know, actually. Whoa, this is crazy. Tell me about it, Molly. <laughs> I think it's kind of fun. Like a water slide. What are we doing up at 6 o'clock in the morning? It's not us, Molly. It's Pookie. Why is she running down the street? <sighs> Push yourself harder, Brookie. Push yourself harder. Whoa. <laughs> she seems kind of insane out right now. She seems kind of quay quay. What's she doing? Um, I think she's doing some sort of workout. Where'd she go? I don't know, but why would she be up this early doing this? I think she might be training or something. <sighs> now she's riding a bike back. Okay, this is just insane. I wouldn't even get out of bed before like nine if I didn't have to. Okay, I can do this. Come on, I gotta beat my time. Go, go, go. She's very motivational to herself. <laughs> Where's she going, Molly? Let's follow her. Good idea. Why is she just staring at the lake like that? I don't know. <laughs> it's way too cold to go swimming today. Besides, it's only 6.30 in the morning. Brr. She's doing something. Well, she's drinking some water. Well, maybe she's just relaxing after her. Oh, my God. She's going in the water. That water is freezing. <sighs> she's trying to swim to the other side of Lake Madison. What a cuckoo. Molly, I think she might be training for the Iron Man. What is the Iron Man? I mean, I know who Iron Man is. <laughs> he wears a red suit, flies around. Molly, no, Iron Man competition. It's very, very elite. You have to be the best athlete on the planet, pretty much. Huh, I wonder why Brookie wants to do that. I mean, doesn't she just want to sit around all day and eat cupcakes? I totally would. Mmm, well, these cupcakes are delicious. Mmm, I love them so much. I could eat 400 more of them. Maybe I will. <laughs> this is the life. Mm. It's so good. Cupcakes, I love you. Cupcakes. <laughs> Molly, snap out of it. Oh, my goodness. You're inside someone else's brain having a daydream about cupcakes. Holy guacamole. <laughs> cupcakes are delicious. Stop it, Molly. Stop thinking about cupcakes. <sighs> well, I wonder what Brookie's doing now. It looks like she's eating something. I wonder what it is. I have to eat all this protein so I can build my muscle. So much protein. But then everyone will know my dark secret. Ooh, now we're getting to the good stuff. You mean your best friend training for a highly elite competition isn't the good stuff? No, not at all. I want to hear the dark secret. Oh, my stomach feels weird. Oh, oh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, there are no words right now. Um, uh, Molly, I think I'm gonna pass out. I don't feel so good. This is your dark secret? You, you, you're, you're kidding me, right? Well, where are we? Molly, I, I think, I think, ah, I just got farted at. Ah, I landed in the toilet. Ah! Molly, I think we're inside, I'm, we're inside Bookie Cookie's worst nightmare. What, having to eat all this protein? You gotta eat all these beans, I guess. Yeah, and then what happens is she has gas in front of everybody, and she's super embarrassed. 
Well, I couldn't hear you. I have to go eat this giant burrito. Hey, why'd you eat that burrito? Molly, there's a bunch of people in here that are going to know she is super farty. Oh, well, I don't think that's such a bad thing. Okay, yes, it is. I'm so sorry, everyone, but I have to fart. <laughs> what? Is that Brookie? It is, Molly. She can't stop farting. Um, okay, I, I want to get out of here because her worst nightmare is also mine. I mean, eating all the beans and stuff is really cool and, and whatnot, but, like, having to, like, be farted at a million times, no thanks. Whoa, look at all these wedges of cheese. Is that Dad? No, I think it's just someone that looks like Dad. Dad wouldn't be in Bookie's brain in, in this giant fart nightmare. I don't know, Dad farts a lot. And Brookie spends a lot of time at our house, so uh, she's probably noticed all his farting. Ooh, a stinky cabbage! Wait, can I fart in here too? Molly, do not attempt to fart in there. You will change the course of Bookie's nightmare. Maybe I'll break her free from it. Let her know that everybody farts, Brookie. Everybody farts. Everybody farts. Brookie, everybody farts. Oh, that was a stinking duty one. Sorry to do this to you. Whoa, I fart cats. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm going to fart this person. <laughs> See, Brookie? We all fart. Yeah, it's totally normal to fart. Even Daisy farts. No, I don't. <laughs> Just kidding. Daisy, you have butterfly farts? Of course you would. Your, par your farts would be total butterflies. Ah! Brookie farted again! It's like a horrible gas smell! Of course it is, Molly. What do you think it's supposed to be? Uh-oh. This person's back for revenge. Molly, um, maybe we should go back into the real world now. Get out of Bookie's brain. Okay, um, give us the shrink or the grow up potion. We already took the shrinking pro potion. Now we have to um drink the enlarging potion. <laughs> I farted. Uh, that's the thing, Molly. Um, I sort of spilled it. What? We're stuck in this fart nightmare forever? Daisy! Hey guys, what's up? Today I'm playing a really interesting game called Head Destroyer 9000. <laughs> hey guys, I think this might be pretty funny. And um, I think it's going to smush me. I really, I really, really do. So, um, I'm a little afraid right now because I'm not sure what's going to happen, but here we go. What? I have to buy to have my head smushed? Who's going to pay to have their head smushed? Okay, this is a VIP product. Let's go try something else. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, guys, this isn't going to be good. Oh, it took my head off. Oh, my gosh, I have no head. My head is over. Oh, it's going to smush it. Oh, 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 man, my head is a pancake. Um, You guys are probably wondering how I'm talking to you right now, especially since I have no mouth. Wait a minute. My head's back. Okay, that's good news. <laughs> I totally need to keep my head. Don't lose your head over it. Oh, here we go. Here's the next one. Oh, seriously, this one took my head off too. What's it going to do? What's? It? Oh, my gosh. What's it doing? Give me back my head. Oh, it squeezed my head into orange juice. Ew. Oh, do I get to drink it now? <laughs> that was so funny. Guys, if you think this game is super funny, slam that like button. What's going to happen to him? I'm kind of afraid to find out. Let's see. Oh, they're squeezing him into juice too. That one's VIP. There's a lot of VIPs in here. I might pay for one. I'm not sure. Is this more juice squeezing? No, I changed my mind. Oh my gosh, I can't leave. Oh, oh, oh. Holy guacamole, people. They're going to make me into grape juice this time. Oh, it's squeezing me like a grape. Ew! I'm running away. I can't even watch this. I'm losing my head over it. Wait, does my head ever come back? Okay, there's my head. <laughs> guys, don't forget to subscribe, okay? I wanted to tell you guys that because subscribing is cool. No, seriously, we do fun games like this, like getting smushed. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Whoa, there's only, look at me. I look weird. Let's see that. That was cool. Let's see that one again. It squishes me into like a little pancake. <laughs> look at me. Oh, bleh. <laughs> Doesn't squeeze you that way forever though. I have a feeling this one's going to kick me like a soccer ball because there's like a goalie there and a soccer net there. A goalie net or whatever. Oh, <laughs> there goes my head. It's like going down the hallway. Okay, that wasn't a very good shot. Try again. Whack! Oh, I just got a goal. Oh, I'm definitely going to have a headache after that one. What? I didn't realize I had head juice down here. Glug, 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 glug. Ew! That's gross. Okay, let's go to the next one. This game is so weird. And oddly fun. Whoa, this guy's tall. He's going to be smushed. He's going to be a smushed tall guy. Yeah. Okay, I'll get smushed and look how much shorter I'm going to be. He wants to get smushed again. Let's see if we can get smushed together. Oh, it's going to smush both of us. Oh, you got smushed and I didn't. Ha ha. I didn't get smushed. What's this? Something says, okay, I have to, do I have to do this myself? Push this. And what happens? Do I have to go in here? Hello? I'm not sure what happens. Then this. And then this. I don't understand this one. Hmm. I'm going to try a different one. Oh, there's an obby in here too? Seriously? Should we try one of these VIPs first though, guys? I feel like we should. Let's go over here to one of these VIPs and see what these do. I really like this VIP one over here. Look at this. It's like a whole room. Some sort of crazy head smushing going on in here. Oh, 50 Robux. Why not? I've got 50 Robux and I want to show you guys what happens in here. Let's do this. Um, guys, my head is following me. Hey! Don't worry. I didn't lose my head. It's just floating around behind me. Uh, no. Actually, my head's over there. What's it gonna do? Oh! It smushed my head! Now what's it doing? Oh my gosh! It's putting flames on my head! My head is, like, floating above me. I have two heads. What's it doing? Making me a snack? Ew, I don't know about that one. Can I have my head back? Okay, thanks. Let's try this one now. Now it's taking my head off. And I don't know why I have a floating head following me, but whatever. Oh, it smushed it! Head destroyer 9000. It's like flame broiled head. Have it your way. <laughs> bon appetit! I'll take that, please. I think these all do the same thing, actually. Hey, don't lose your head over this, guys. <laughs> Smash! <laughs> Look at my floating head. It's like, don't worry. I'm a backup if you need it. Crazy games like this make me happy. Seriously, they do, because this game is so weird. Oh, a dance party! I could dance without my head. Oh, wait, no, my head came back. I've got two heads. Two heads are better than one. Right? Right. My head that's following me is very quiet. It's not saying anything. Coming soon. Well, that's not the obby. Is, there, is the obby not set up yet? Let's go find out. I think it is. Did it, did it. Oh no, the Abby's over here. Wait, where's my head? There it is. <laughs> Come on. Um, okay, I already died. I just started the Abby and I already died. Not very good. I didn't do very good. You think you think I do better? I have four sets of eyes now. Where am I? Didn't did I not spawn up in the same spot? I'm so lost! Where's the Abby? Oh, there it is. No, that's not it. Okay, it's over here. Holy guacamole. I was so confused. Wait, what's this do? 
I think you need more than one person to get on these. Oh, this time I hope I can make it onto the Abbey. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to push you. I think I kind of pushed that person over the edge. Whoa. Go, go, go. I think it's kind of weird that you have like a pet head in this thing. I think that's really weird, but I like this game. It's funny. Oh, so far. Oh, no. Don't make me start at the beginning. Oh, my gosh. This obby's going to take me forever. I must complete it. It's my mission for the day. And I failed again. Oh, my gosh. Guys, will you slam the like button and show me support? Come on, guys. Slam that like button. Okay, I need to call on the unicorn. Part of the unicorn with a sparkly horn. Come on, unicorn. Seriously. Let's get this obby done together. I need a little bit of magic to help me here. Please don't push me off the edge. It took me a lot of times to get up here. I did try a lot of times. Do, do, do. Ow, oh, I hit my head. That was very tricksy. I didn't like that. Oh, thank goodness I made it to here. No! Oh! Oh, my gosh. I can't even do this, Abby. I think something happened when they smashed my brain. <laughs> they smushed my head and it smashed my brain. Okay, we're both jumping at the same time. Just go ahead of me. Seriously. Ooh, it says I'm a VIP. VIP in it. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Okay, this is where I always die, so let's try not to die. No! Oh, thank goodness I didn't. I think I'm just going to live here now. <laughs> I'm too afraid to move. Oh, you barely make it onto that next one. Oh, what's this tricksy business? Huh? Oh my gosh, I made it. Oh my gosh, I might actually beat this obby. I better not say that too loud because then I'll mess up. Yes, yes! Oh! I've made it farther than I've ever made it before. Come on, extra head. Keep up. I mean, I don't have you. No, you don't have legs or anything, but you're just floating there. How hard can this really be? Oh! <laughs> Guys, this obby is so difficult. Um, I'm going to have to go for now because I need to eat a cupcake. This is like craziness. Uh, and I don't even know where it goes. Like, after it goes there, it goes there. But then what? Then you just end? Let's see where it goes after she gets over here. I feel like it just ends. That would be totally wrong if it just ended. Wait, she just disappeared. Where'd she go? Where's he gonna go? Where's this guy up here going? See, it just ends! Oh my gosh. Did they give you a hot dog or something? Because that's... I really, oh my gosh, there's fish under there. Can you guys see that? I didn't even notice that. It's amazing! Maybe when you get to the end of the obby, it lets you swim under the fish. <gasps> With the fish? That would be amazing! Because see, it like goes down there, but if you go down there, you die. I don't know. Let me try diving down there. Yep, it definitely kills you. <laughs> Alright, guys. Thanks so much for watching me play Head Destroyer 9000. Guys, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell for more weird videos and fun videos just like this one. I'll see you guys next time. Bye! OMG, I love this game. It's so fun. Hmm, I wonder if there's anything left to do for our vacation. Um, let me see. I've got to look at my checklist. Molly, I'm looking at my checklist and I'm I'm seeing some things I need to ask you about for our vacation tomorrow. Mom, not right now. I'm playing my game. Molly, I need you to help me with this, please. Ugh, I'm starting to get really stressed out about vacation tomorrow and, and there's so much to do and you're not helping me. Whoa, Mom, chill out. It's all going to be okay, all right? Don't stress. That's that's not what a vacation is for. Okay, well, I'm just saying that I'm the mom, so I have a lot of pressure on me to make this trip perfect, and I don't want to forget anything. Mom, you're not going to forget anything. You're like super mom. Of course you won't. Oh, I hope you're right, Molly. I'm just looking at this, this to-do list, and, and it's so long. It's like the size of a book. Mom, you don't need to-do list. Here, just take this and throw it away. <laughs> Molly, what did you do with my list? I threw it out the window. You don't need lists, Mom. Everything's good. 
Well, I don't know, Molly. I, I think I think I might forget something. You're not gonna forget anything. Trust me, Mom. Okay, let's see. Ooh, Mom, it looks like you packed a bunch of yummy snacks for our vacation. Yeah, I thought we'd need those. Um, I don't know. What kind of food do they serve in Hawaii? Hawaii has delicious food, Mom. Don't worry about it. Well, at least we'll have some snacks for when we're going there. Yeah, good point. Now, let's see. What else did I need to do? Nothing, Mom. Everything's good. Daisy. Daisy, what are you doing? I'm sitting here playing my game. Yeah, Mom's about to come in and yell at you and say stop playing your game. Really, Molly? Why would she do that? Molly, why are you turning the lights on and off? Because it was dark in here, Daisy. Jeepers. Mom's going to come in here and say, get off of your computer, Daisy. You have to pack and you have to. She was like, just like yelling at me and freaking out. Hey, girls. Um, Want to help me uh, make it so that your mom's not freaking out about vacation? Sure, we'd love to help you, Dad, but I think she's going to freak out about it no matter what. Yeah, she sent me in here to tell you girls that you need to pack your bathing suits. Did you remember your bathing suits? Yeah, Dad, we remembered our bathing suits. We're going to Hawaii. Jeepers. Yeah, Dad, I've been packed for like three days. Wow, Daisy, aren't you an overachiever? <laughs> okay, girls, well, I'll go back and talk to your mom and see what else you have to do. Daisy, are you going to take Sparkles the Unicorn? Of course I am, Molly. Are you going to take Oscar the Octopus? No, he's going to stay here. Well, actually, Daisy, if you were going to take any of your stuffed animals to Hawaii, you should take Oscar because he's an octopus and he'd love the ocean. I know, Molly, but he's seen the ocean before because he's an octopus. But Sparkles the Unicorn hasn't seen the ocean before, so I'm taking her. Okay, Daisy, whatever you say. Bye! Molly, where are you going? Back to my room to play. Okay, I'm sure I have everything packed and ready to go. I can't wait to go to Hawaii. I can't wait to go to Hawaii. Daisy, you're singing too loud. I can't concentrate on my game. Well, then close your door, Molly. Cease. Hey, don't slam my door. Going to Hawaii. Going to Hawaii. Daisy, I can still hear you singing. No, you can't, Molly. You don't even know what I'm singing. Yes, I do, Daisy. You're saying, going to Hawaii. Going to Hawaii. I hear everything you're saying. I wonder if Mom, I wonder if Mom will mind if I eat a muffin. Yes, Molly, I'll mind. Those are for the trip tomorrow. Mom, I think you need to, like, make some lemonade and go hang out in the pool. What are you talking about, Molly? Tomorrow's vacation, not today. Yeah, I know, but you're really stressing out about vacation. You're not supposed to stress about vacation. You're supposed to be happy about vacation. Oh, you're probably right, Molly. I have been running around like crazy all week trying to get ready for our trip to Hawaii. It's making me crazy. I need to stop right now. I'm sure everything will be fine. That's right, Mom. Come on. Out you go. Go on. Go outside. I'm going, Molly. Now just relax, Mom. Drink your... What is that? That's not lemonade. It's, it's, it's purple. Um, I decided on grape juice. Okay, well, your grape juice. Now come over here, Mom, and go down this giant slide. Whee! Ha! <laughs> so refreshing. Go, Mom! Go, Mom! Go! Go! Go, Mom! Whee! Ha, <laughs> Mom! That was so awesome! Are you having fun in the pool? Whee! Hey, Molly! Oh, hey, Cookie Fan Brianna! Um, we're, we're, like, just swimming in the pool right now because we're trying to chill and, like, relax after, um, preparing to go to Hawaii. And my mom seriously needs to relax because she was stressing out. Oh, Molly, I can't believe how dark it's getting out. Look at the stars. Aren't they beautiful? Yeah, Mom, they're totally beautiful. And look at the moon. Moon is so pretty, too. Well, Molly, now that the stars are out, you know what that means. Oh, it's not bedtime already, is it? Yep, you'll have to say goodbye to your friend, and you'll see her in a week. Okay, um, Brianna, I'm sorry, but I have to go to bed now, because we're leaving for Hawaii in the morning. So, I'll see you in a week, okay? Bye! Oh, I'm starving. I'm gonna have a little snack before I go to bed. Ooh, a yogurt. That sounds good. Daisy, Mom said you have to go to bed! Okay, Molly! I see you tomorrow. Yeah, see you tomorrow. 
Oh, whoops, I forgot to turn off the light. <laughs> kind of hard to sleep with the light on. Yeah, yeah, I had to get up really early because pretty much we're leaving at the crack of dawn. First, I better brush my teeth because nobody wants stinky breath on the plane to Hawaii. Huh. Brushing my teeth, brushing my teeth, brushing my teeth. Brush, brush, brush. Oh, I'm starving. Mom, mom, what's for breakfast? No answer from my mom. Must be she didn't hear me. Gotta yell louder. Mom! Mom! What's for breakfast? What? She's still not answering me. Okay, she must just be out, like, in the kitchen making breakfast and she can't hear me. Mom! Mom! I'm starving! What's for breakfast? Ew. Must be these, these hot dogs wouldn't be for breakfast. They're probably for the trip, but I'm gonna eat one anyway because I'm starving. <laughs> hot dogs for breakfast. Ew, kind of gross, kind of delicious. Yum, 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 yum. Ah, that's better. My tummy is all full. Hey, where is everybody? Come on, we don't want to miss our plane. Baby Kira? Okay, baby Kira's up. Probably everybody's in the living room. Whoa, nobody's in here. Mom? Dad? Daisy, wake up! It's time to leave. Daisy? Where is everybody? Daisy! Okay, she's not in her bathroom. Maybe she's in her closet. Okay. Guys, it's not funny to play hide and seek on the day that we're leaving for Hawaii, okay? We can't be late, okay? Mom? Dad? What? Where is everybody? Oh, I know where they are. They're probably out front packing up the trunk of the car with all of our luggage. Mom? Dad? Did you pack up all the luggage? Oh my gosh, where's the car? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. They left me home alone. Um, Molly, are you okay? No, my parents left me home alone while they went to Hawaii. Ooh, wow. Uh, that doesn't sound good. Oh no. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. They left me home alone. OMG, this is so bad. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I can't wait to get to Hawaii and relax. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Oh my gosh, stop the car. Stop the car. What is it, Mom? Oh my goodness, you seem really upset. That's because I forgot something really important. Oh dear, I'm sure it's nothing too important. It's super important. I can't believe I forgot it. Oh man. Oh, what is it, Mom? What's wrong? I forgot. I forgot the snacks. Oh, I made all those delicious hot dogs and... Oh, dear, it'll be okay. Yeah, Mom, don't even worry about it. We could just stop at McDonald's on the way. Ugh, McDonald's? But I made those delicious snacks for us. Molly loves McDonald's. She'll just get a happy meal, right, Molly? Molly? <gasps> Molly! Where, where's Molly? What are you talking about, Daisy? She's right back there in the back seat with you. Um, I hate to tell you this, Mom and Dad, but Molly's not in the back seat. What? Molly's not in the back seat? Did, did we accidentally put her on the roof of the car? <laughs> Don't be silly, dear. I'm sure she's back there. Daisy, quit pranking us. Don't look. Nobody's in the seat next to me. Ah! We left Molly home alone. Ah, now this is the life. No sister to annoy me. I've got the house all to myself. Uh, being home alone is pretty amazing. <laughs>
Oh my gosh, oh my gosh! What am I gonna win? What am I gonna win? I wanna win the monkey. I wanna win the monkey! Um, I'm gonna win this special little coin. <laughs> wow, I wonder what that means. Yes, I got something! I don't know really what it does, but it was still fun to play. <laughs> okay, guys, now we have to try to escape the bowling alley! Do I need shoe rental? <laughs> Escaping the bowling alley! Wow! <laughs> I'm bowling. Wait, am I the ball? Oh my gosh, I think I turned into a bowling ball! That was crazy! <laughs> wow, is this where all the bowling pins go when you, when you knock them down? This is kind of crazy. I never knew. Climbing up this ladder! Ew, it's kind of gross back here. Oh my gosh! It's totally evil behind the bowling alley! Who would have ever thought? They're like melting... They're like melting stuff. They're making hot lava back here. Do not fall! Because if you fall... Seriously, look how far you fall. Into a big vat of lava! So scary. Whoa, this roll. I need to use the power of the unicorn. I can just feel it. Because it's going to get harder. Do you guys like this game? I think it's pretty cool. Whoa, whoa. That was crazy. Boing. 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 So far, I'm doing really good without the power of the unicorn. I'm like winning this game all on my own. That's pretty much unheard of. <laughs> I always need the power of the unicorn. Oh my gosh, there's saw blades back here. Oh my gosh, it's cutting on me. It's cutting me. Oh my gosh. Ah! I went down with all that sawed lumber. That was pretty crazy. Wait for it. Wait for it. I died anyway! What? What? No, that wasn't fair! Ah! And then I knocked my head onto the ground! Marshmallow head. That's what I call it when you die. Because watch the next time I die in this game, your head looks like a marshmallow. <laughs> yes! I made it! I'm awesome like that. Boing. 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 Oh my gosh! Green oozy slime! Ew! Do you guys like this game, Escape the Bowling Alley? Let me know in the comments below. Ah! <laughs> wow, that was a close one. It like drips on you. Boing, 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 boing. Yes, I made it. I've done really good this time, guys. I've only died a couple of times. Normally I die like three million times. <laughs> Here comes the huge bowling balls. Go, go, go. Molten lava! Oh my gosh, my marshmallow head turned into a s'more. <laughs> ah! 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 This part's so hard. I have to use the power of the unicorn. Power of the unicorn! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh! Go, go, go! Ah! I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, just know it! Oh, I made it. Good, good deal. Now I gotta jump on these giant... Ah! Oh my gosh, I'm still... I'm on fire! Oh my gosh, look! I, I was underneath the lava and I was on fire. That's just not right. Jumping on these giant... Um, what are these called? Oh yeah, pins. I forgot for a minute. <laughs> bowling pins. Ah! The bowling ball hit me! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I just got done saying... Like one minute ago, that I was doing awesome. Now all of a sudden I'm dying. Ah! <laughs> okay, I gotta use the power of the unicorn. Because I'm really, really stinking. Power of the unicorn! Do you think unicorns like to go bowling? <laughs> They probably shoot the bowling ball down the alley with their horn. 
<laughs> I just want you to close your eyes for me right now and imagine a bunch of unicorns having a pizza party at a bowling alley. Can you see it? Can you see it with your imagination? <laughs> I can. It's hilarious. You should probably not close your eyes off if you're actually playing this game. Because then you will die. And that will stink. Ah! Just like that. See, I closed my eyes to think about the unicorns playing bowling and then I died. Oh my gosh. <sighs> I bet you knew, never knew this is where your bowling pins went. To this lava land with this oozing green slime waterfalls. Have you guys ever eaten s'mores before? It's like when you roast a marshmallow over the fire and then you put chocolate on it so it melts mm, like slimy. Well, not slimy. I was going to say like um, the slimy ooze, but that's not right because slimy ooze is gross and um, melted chocolate is delicious. <laughs> but anyway, when you make a s'more, you put the chocolate on to the marshmallow. The marshmallow melts the chocolate and then you put it between two graham crackers. And I swear, guys, it's the best thing in the whole universe. That's my favorite thing, chocolate. Okay, I don't understand what's going on here, but I feel like I'm definitely gotta be careful. I think you have to try to beat this scary thing, but I'm not sure. Ah, go in there, go in there! I can't even talk right now, guys. I'm, I'm trying to make it. Oh, my gosh. I'm not sure I'm going to make it. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Ah! I made it. Phew. That was so close, guys. Now I have to try to get out of here, like, super fast. There's the exit. Oh, my gosh. Go! Oh, I made it. Oh, my gosh. Look. It's like I'm super tiny and there's a giant claw game. That's so cool. I died! Don't go that way. <laughs> oh yeah! I finally figured it out. <laughs> it looks like there's a guy in a tub over there. What? <laughs> in a slime tub. I don't get that. <laughs> what are you doing? You don't want to take a bath in it! <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm in a vat of money! Why would I ever want to escape that? Boing, 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 boing. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Okay guys, this part is like not easy! I was just going to say it was kind of easy, and then I died. So I guess I shouldn't say that. Boing. Because that one jump is, like, really hard. I don't think I can make it that far. I'm not sure what to do. Oh, I see what to do. What? No, I didn't. No, I did. <laughs> Whoa. My head is like boing, 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 boing. Super sonic speed. Wow. Boing, 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 boing. I have to go through super sonic speed. Woo. Woo. Whoa. This is super fun when I go super fast. Almost there. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I made it. Woohoo! Now where? Whoa, 
there's a giant ball pit below me. Kind of want to jump in it, but I think I'll probably die. Yeah, I died. That stinks. I feel like you should be able to jump into the ball pit and be like, wee! <laughs> Okay, where do I go now, guys? I don't understand. Oh my gosh, I died! I don't get it. Did you guys play this part of the game? Can you tell me what to do in the comments below? I feel like you have to climb down that thing or something. But it's like really hard. Oh, maybe you have to jump into that little box right there so you don't die. Yeah, that's it. Woohoo! But then you d I died here. <laughs> Whoops. What is your favorite Roblox escape game? Let me know in the comments below. This one's really fun. I like this one. I like Escape Grandma. I think that one's my favorite. It's hilarious. If you guys haven't played it yet, you should. It's super funny. We also have a video of Escape Grandma. If you go on to the Toy Heroes games, you can watch it. It's super fun. And, you know, don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes games. And also, hit the little notification bell so you can be the first one to see our videos. Do, 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 climbing up this ladder. Do, 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 to the sky. Oh, my gosh, guys. I'm climbing, 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 still climbing. Oh my gosh, still climbing, still climbing. And then at the top, you have to jump over this slimy ooze. Do you guys like playing with slime? It's pretty cool. More ladders? Ugh, okay. Okay, now I'm like up in the rafters, but for some reason, there's a fireplace up there? Yeah, I don't get it. I have to climb. I died! No! I was so close to escaping. Now I'll never leave the bowling alley! <laughs> Just kidding. I'm, I'm still gonna leave. You can't, you can't hold me back, evil bowling alley. I love bowling. I think it's so much fun. But if I was trapped in one forever, I don't know if it would be so bad. They have hamburgers there. <laughs> and a claw game. Oh my gosh, I think I made it! <gasps> I think I might have made it, guys. I did! Guys, I'm outside the bowling alley! Awesome! Woo! Yes! Best day ever! Guys, I think you are amazing. And I'm gonna run super fast! Woo! <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> this is like my favorite thing to do after a game. Wait a minute! Oh my gosh! That must put me back in the bowling alley! Oh no! Well guys, thanks so much for watching this super fun Toy Hero Games video. Make sure you like and subscribe to the Toy Heroes games and don't forget to hit the little notification bell so you can be the first one to know when we put out a video. I'll see you guys in our next awesome Roblox video. Bye!